Hello there. We meet again. My name is the Bread Pirate, and today we're going to be playing on the Breath of the Wild Minecraft SMP server. But first, we're going to give some people some time to roll in here. So, let's do that. Where's the button? Click the button. Haha! -ha! We have clicketh the button. This is the button of doom, which allows us to do the pre-stream doodles. So, I'm going to start taking suggestions as soon as I get my chat set up, because it's, it's not actually in the right spot. I like to use the pop-out chat. There's a setting which makes the chat pop out from its tab and become its own thing. It's, it's cool. YouTube is a cool platform. I have to do something, but we'll tune in later, says Dark Brave. Don't worry. Don't worry. I totally understand. Hey, I've been live streaming a lot. If you can't make it, that's on me. That's on me, because the, the responsibility never lies on the viewer. It relies on the content creator to do a good job. Bread is cool. Prove me wrong, says Water Crate. Uh, I'll tell you what's not cool. My stream yesterday. Holy cow, was the audio on that one garbage. There's there's your proof right there. Reeks of unprofessionalism. There's there's an issue. Also, I'm very late to streams. There's an excuse. There's a reason I'm uncool. Bread destroyed by facts and logic. Gotta go. Toodles, says Foxy Girl. Hey, no worries. No worries. If you guys can only stop by for a second, I will take anything. And let me know if the um, if the audio quality is fine this time, if there's any delay in the stuff that's happening on screen, or if the visuals look crappy. Any of that feedback is helpful. Uh, you always stream at the most inconvenient time, says Omega Dan Kong. Yes, I do. Uh, Zeldian says, as a mod, I am legally required to be in every stream. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that we have a legally binding agreement, which I don't remember signing, but apparently we do have, meaning you need to be here right now. Let's see some other things. Tyler says, game over sound, five seconds later, Link dies. <laughs> yes, that was, um, that was how it worked yesterday. It was bad. Audio looks and visuals look awesome, says Jimito K. Anima. Jumento, Jumento, my bad. I was looking at that and I'm having a brain fart. There's a lot of fog in my head right now. Partly because I had a busy week. Uh, audio is great, but chat is inverted. Oh yeah, yeah, chat's inverted. I don't really have a way of fixing that. I, I, I could do, I, I could go to transform and flip it, but I don't know if it would look good. Let's try it. Oh, you know, that's not, that's not half bad. Uh, the issue here is gotta make yeah there we go we'll do that that works fine uh, I might shrink it a little bit though we're gonna shrink it a little bit there we go and then move it down and move it back up there we go look actually you know that was a great suggestion and now I want to test something if I go here does it still work that still works fine if I go to here that works fine yeah okay so if we do that that that's that's an okay system we're gonna we're gonna go with that Whew, what are the other things people are saying? Favorite drink, says Unknown Trixie. I love a root beer and I love tea. Those are my two favorites. Yoshi in a costume of Yoshi, says Kefir Baton. Kurt, I never had to know how to say that name. Kerr, I'm going to call you Kerr, knows how this works. Every time we start these streams, well, whenever I can, I like to start with a pre-stream doodle. And we're going to do that again today. So allow me to make a little Yoshi wearing a costume of Yoshi. Hmm. How do I do that? Yoshi and I, oh, you mean my cat. Okay, my cat's name is Yoshi. He's talking about my cat. My cat Yoshi in a Yoshi suit. So first we gotta draw my cat. We're gonna do like a little bunny ears. Not well, cat ears, they're little cat ears. And then we're gonna do a little Yoshi nose here with the two eyes. Uh, that's not right. We'll we'll get to that part later. No, we'll do that now. We're going to do the eyes. And then we'll do the green part. Uh, Yoshi has a decent sized head, right? And uh, and then we'll give him little feet. And uh, and um, he has a, a Koopa shell on the back, which is actually red. So we're going to draw a red Koopa shell. And his, his feet are also supposed to be red. So I'll change those. Yeah. Look at that. I am the greatest artist to ever be born on this continent. North America, everybody's been blown away. I am the best. 
Yeah, I can only stream at 480p on my laptop because it's a potato, says Water Crate C, uh, GD. I'm, I'm sorry for your loss. I'm sorry. I know a cat named Yoshi too, says Jumento. That's cool. I like it. Beautiful and narcissistic, says Zeldian. Yes, narcissism. I get my narcissism from Technoblade. In some ways, I like to play two different characters on my channel. I play the genuine me, who I like to think is, I, I try to be humble, meek, not giving myself too much credit for stuff, letting other people shine. But then the other half of the time, I end up being Technoblade and just have this overinflated ego and just try and try and entertain people with the absurdity of my claims. I like to do both. Draw the muffin Yoshi stole. Ha! Good throwback. Yes, we'll do that. Well, what color is a muffin tin? Ah, uh, we'll go with yellow. And so it's a, it's a little muffin wrapper. And we'll draw a little line there. There, there, and there. Oh my goodness, a door just banged behind me. The bathroom door on the other side of that wall just banged because of the wind. <laughs> Okay, so that's the first part. Now we're gonna do the muffin itself. And as somebody in chat rightfully pointed out, muffins are tan. So we're gonna do um, that. We're gonna do that. And then we're gonna do a little of that. And we'll give it some sprinkles. I, I'm, I don't know if it had chocolate. I don't think it had chocolate in it, but we're gonna do chocolate, little sprinkles so that it looks tasty. Isn't that nice? That's a good muffin. I nailed that. For once in my life, I think I nailed a doodle during the doodle segment. Whew, anything else people want to see? Uh, bread is the new Da Vinci. Yes, new uh, Van Gogh, the new Da Vinci, the new Michelangelo. Draw the muffin Yoshi stole. That was one I heard already. Muffin is tan. Oh, what other things? I want chocolate, says Claire Riley. We are gonna do that right now then. I will draw you the world's greatest freaking candy bar. Uh, we're gonna start. We're gonna start with the candy bar. This is a very foodie-related one so far. Uh, and you know what? I'm actually gonna put bite marks into it. Start with bite marks, uh, and we'll do the wrapper in a second. First, we have to do little squares because chocolate is in squares. And there we go. That's pretty good. Now we're gonna do the wrapper. This is where things get tricky because the inside of the wrapper is metallic and the rest of it, well, we don't know what color it is. We got to choose. I'm going to make it like that. And it peels there. Then we're going to have to do the rest. What color do we want? Let's do green. Green, because we already have used green. Green, we'll give it a bucket. And uh, then we'll, we'll write some little little text on it just so we can advertise on it. Who are we advertising? What kind of chocolate company? Hmm. Who makes chocolate in the Zelda series? Nobody makes chocolate in the Zelda series. We'll just call it Grazzy's. Grazzy Chocolate, because he's the guy who runs the Zelda SMP that we're going to be playing on in a bit. Grass. Chocolate. Chocolata. Grass Chocolata. There we go, baby. Try to draw a world map from memory, says Namus. This is a fun challenge. All right, I'll do it. We'll put it in uh, this this area. I, I didn't draw it. This area. We're going to put it in this area. So, let's start with America. We're going to start with North America. And I'm going to use a, a medium-sized pen. Uh, we're going to start with Alaska and work our way over. Alaska. There's the bay, the Hudson Bay there. Um, oh, gosh, this is too big. Let's start smaller. Alaska, there's a bunch of islands that are in that area. Hudson Bay, the Quebecs are over there. Um, there's another area there. I'm gonna draw Long Island because I remember Long Island unlike some people. Florida, this is still way too large. This is still way, way too large. Okay, whatever, we'll, we'll live with this. <laughs> I'll just draw it into the other areas here. Um, South America is going to be at the bottom and is going to be... Ooh, that's ugly. That's the ugliest South America I have ever seen. Now we were looking. Now it's looking hot. Okay, I think it curves that way. And we'll draw the Falkland Island right there. Um, there we go. Now we're going to come back up. We have the Gulf of California there. And I'll just kind of fake this. There we go. 
that's uh, that's North America. We got Greenland over here. It's just kind of a blob. Iceland is right there. We have uh, a Cuba. I'll just draw Cuba because it's the biggest island right there. This is pretty good so far. This is pretty good so far. I'm also going to draw the uh, Great Lakes. There's one right here, another right there, and uh, Michigan is somewhere there. Yeah, it's like there's a few Great Lakes. That's not, that's not accurate. That's not to scale. Where's Alaska? This is Alaska. I butchered it. It's terrible. I know. I know. Uh, I, I, I squeezed it in there. <laughs> I squeezed it in there. Draw an apple being depicted as a friend and not as food, says European apple. Oh, a little bit late for that. We got to draw Europe now. You guys are challenging me. Now, Britain is my my bane of my existence. I suck at drawing Britain, but we're going to give it an attempt. Uh, there we go. That's Ireland. It's way too close. Don't have time to think about it. Let's start with Denmark. We're going to be a little bit funny today, and we're going to start with Denmark. Then we're going to do the Baltic states. Swoop over here. There is the bay. I don't remember what's... No, sorry, the gulf. I don't know what's called. The gulf by Finland. Oh, wow. We're not going to include Asia. We don't have room for Asia. I will, we will make room for Asia. I, bet, I was challenged to draw a world map. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to commit to this. There's France, Spain, Italy, Yoshi. Sorry, Turks. You're not going to even get included in this. Uh, you're not you're not even in on this <laughs> get dunked on baby okay then we got africa africa there's the cape of somalia it's not going to even feature south america south africa south africa does not even exist and africa is huge africa is huge wow don't question it don't question it uh we got this location i think this is saudi arabia here i'm I always get this part confused. I, I, there's there's another gulf right there. And then India. <laughs> part two. Part two. Uh, we, we, now, we now have to move into this area. <sighs> I don't know where to start here. I don't know. I, mean, I don't even know. Where, we'll start with India. It's a, it's a nacho. Let's be real. It's a nacho. Um, then we have all these islands over here. Well, not islands, sorry. E East Asian countries. We have East Asian countries right there. There's Korea. Um, there's then Kamkacha. Kamkacha? I can't remember the name of that one. And it actually, it, it goes like that because it gets pretty close to Alaska. And then I don't even know how to draw at the top of Alaska. So a squiggly line is better than anything else. Japan. Uh, there's also a nice long island right there, which Japan owns half of. Uh, nope, my bad. This is the long part of Japan, short part of Japan, Philippines, which have two big islands in the north and the south and a bunch of smaller ones in the middle. Uh, Australia is kind of tricky to draw, so I'm just going to fake this. And I did not forget New Zealand. I did not. Hawaii is over there somewhere. Pretend I drew it. Actually, I'll, I'll draw it right now. Bloop, bloop. There we go. That's Hawaii. You guys can't even see it. I'm sorry. I noticed my face is in the way. <laughs> yeah, uh, New Zealand is there, though. I am not labeling it. Who just said label it? Cardboard? You're getting kicked out. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Did you draw Russia, Alaska? Yeah, Alaska's, Alaska's right here. Russia is right here, or whatever Russia's Alaska is. What did I miss? Y'all unskippable ad. Oh, I'm sorry, Don Kitty. Hey, well, welcome back. Uh, we are, we, we drew the world because somebody suggested it. I don't even know who suggested it. Um, what is the island that's right here? There's a teeny set of islands over there, which are sinking into the ocean. We'll draw those two. And Madagascar, which I'm just going to draw the bottom part of. Oh, you know what? I have all this room down here. Just occurred to me. I have all this room down here. I could have been drawing it this whole time. So we are going to finish it. There we go. South part of Africa. Guys, that's a map of the world from memory. You're, oh, somebody said Antarctica. Um, there, yeah, there we go. Every single continent included. Yes. Mr. Beast, if you don't mind me asking, what's your favorite kind of bread? Says Reese and Polly. I love white bread when I'm making it from scratch for home. Uh, but when I am buying bread, I usually go with whole wheat bread because it's healthier. Yes, so beautiful. Why is the Middle East so tiny next to Africa? <sighs> 
Africa got hungry and it just started eating parts of the Middle East. What could I say? What about the North Pole? I could draw that. That'll be the last thing I draw right now. And then we'll get into the actual stream itself. Boom. Actually, make it a little bit larger. Uh, you know, actually, wait, there's, no there's a North Pole in Alaska. We'll draw it there. Yeah, that's a great idea. Then we have red and white right there. And we're just going to color it white. Boom, boom. Sorry. That's the North Pole. Uh, actually, well, let's give it a small, small black outline just so we could actually tell that it's one pole. Yeah. That's what I always picture when people say there's a pole at the top of a la of the, the world. It's a candy cane pole with yellow on it. I think the Santa movies that I've watched have influenced me as a child. That is the North Pole. The North Pole is not in Alaska, sir. There is a town there named the North Pole. I, I'm sure of it. I must look this up now. I must investigate. Yeah, yeah, North Pole, Alaska. Yeah. Um, oh yeah, it actually has year-round Christmas decorations. That's hilarious. Including candy cane striped street lights. Santa Claus House is a Christmas store with the walls covered in children's letters to Santa and a huge Santa uh, statue outside. Streets have names like Chris Kringle Drive, Mistletoe Lane. Nearby, the Chenna Lake Recreation Area has beaches, nature trails, and picnic areas. That's from Wiki... Um, well, that's from Google. That's from Google. It has a population of 2,200 people. So, pretty small, but very cool. Um, that is that is the North Pole. I drew it. You guys said, draw the North Pole. I just did it. The North Pole town. Yes. Oh, somebody mentioned zucchini bread in the chat. That was Omega Dan Kong. I also love zucchini bread. My mom makes it all the time, and it is it's just immaculate. Anyways, draw a kangaroo in Australia. Okay, fine. Fine. You've convinced me. I will draw a tiny kangaroo in Australia as well. This is going to be a real challenge, though, because I have never drawn a kangaroo before. I mean, I've never drawn a lot of these things before, but a kangaroo especially. So we're going to do the tail. I'm just going to, I'm going to put some effort into the tail there. Those are its feet, and we'll give it little arms, like a dinosaur. It's got ears and a pouch. I need to use a small pen for this. That's a kangaroo. Hey, from a distance, it doesn't look half bad. It's not half bad. Draw a Minecraft Master Sword. No, no, no. I'm sorry. That is all we're going to be doing today. That is the end of the doodles. I'm going to save it, though, as Breath of the Wild in Minecraft stream number... Is this only number three? Wow. Feels like it's been longer than that. Good, good, good suggestions. Drawing the world from scratch. That's a fun starter for the stream. Uh, and actually, I've already burnt 20 minutes. That's insane. But we are at 60 people on the stream. 59, if I could be accurate. Uh, so thank you. Thank you for all having so many people here today. Let's get into the actual thing. We're going to... Oh, oh, somebody asked, what font do you use for the Zelda font? I will answer this before we go, because this is a time-sensitive question. There's a few fonts I use that are Zelda-oriented, and hopefully this helps you. Hylia Serif Beta is the first one. It looks like this. Beta. Um... Capital letters have the more intricate design. Smaller letters have the less intricate design. I personally, I like to use all small letters because the, uh, the the design that's on the big letters makes them a little bit harder to read in thumbnails. Although I don't use it in a thumbnail very often. The other one I use is Ravenna. Ravenna is a, twi uh, I'll spell the name. Venna. It's two E's, N's, okay. Ravenna, this is a Twilight Princess inspired font. And then I think one more which I'll go over is uh, Ganon. There's a Ganon one. Where is that one? Ooh, maybe I won't go over that one. I'll go over a different one. Rock and roll. Rock and roll one. I love this font. I love this font because this, I had to search for this one myself. This was before anybody had found it online. I went through a week of just scrolling through fonts until I found it. This is the font they use for the text in Wind Waker with dialogue. And this is one of my favorites. I use this one a lot. Uh, outside of my iconic font, which I use for most situations, uh, which is called Boulder. I don't know other than that. what to, It's just called Boulder. It's just called Boulder. 
It's a pretty good font. It works for a lot of situations. Oh no! Dog Kitty! Two unskippable ads! Again? It hasn't even been that long. Okay, you know what? Now that you've mentioned it, I'm gonna change it so that we get fewer ads. I just clicked the setting. Kitty, I'm sorry. Nobody should have to get that many ads in a half hour time span. So now, there will be fewer. Thank you for letting me know. Thank you for letting me know. So we fixed it. We fixed it. And look at that! This is great. Try the Rega 1 font, please. Uh, Rega 1? Okay, sure. Uh, you guys... You guys are so easily easily able to distract me. Rega 1. Rega... Rega... I don't think I have Rega 1. I, I don't have that one. Sorry. I thought you saw it and I was like, Oh yeah, sure, we'll try to check it out. Yeah. Best character from Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, says Chompy Chomp. Ah, good question. What is my favorite character from that game? Hmm. Well, it's probably Link. I love Link. He's just a simple guy. He's hard to hate. Uh, I'm gonna save it. And uh, let's get into it. Let's begin. So, where's the button? Where's the button? Ah, there it is. I'm like, I'm like, I'm looking at the, the wrong screen. I'm like, what, what happened to it? Here we are. We're, we're ready. Grazzy's SMP. And I'm sure some people are already going to be here. Because I'm running a little bit late today. Oh. There's Ozzel. Hi, Ozzel. Oh, yo! Yo, fish and loaves! Let's go! This is very hype. This is very hype. Oh. Hey, and it's Solus too. Hello, Solus. Hello, Hello Ozzel. We've been waiting Hello. for you. Hello. Yes. Yes, you have. Well, man, yesterday was crazy. That stream was insane. Yeah, I'm glad that you had fun. Yes, and now we are here together. Oh, who moved my who moved my my chest? Oh, I don't know. I think it moved on its own. I will weed you out. I can smell fear. Was it you, Solace? Oh, okay, you're gone. I can't smell you now. You have seawater on you. Was it you? It was definitely him. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. I see it. It's written all over his pink, plushy, little yellow Yoshi face. What? I can see it. Crazy. It's in his eyes. Well, we gotta take that. We're gonna be using that because today we... Uh, this box of wood supplies, and we're gonna need to get some of our own. It's gonna be exciting, gents. It is going to be exciting. We're going to take over all of Central Hyrule. Sounds good. Are you guys already Ready streaming on your ends? No. no, I'm not. Ah, you decided not to today. Uh, what yeah, do we get yeah, here? Yes. Efficiency. Hey, who wants an efficiency two pickaxe? Or axe. Uh, sorry, it's just oh, an axe. Sure. Boom. Take that. Uh, and if you, Thank you have one, if you have a weak one, or if you have a weaker one and Solus doesn't already, give him a pick an, an axe too. We're going to need it. We are going to need to bring a lot of wood with us for this. We are rebuilding the crappiest fort in Hyrule. Let's go. <laughs> do you have the item frame that went up here? Uh, oh, yes, I do. I do have it. I what was in I, there? I that was remember food. what it had. And a carrot, yeah. Uh, yes, it had a carrot. Good eye. Good eye. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, is there anything we need before we get going? Wood? Uh, no. Well, I, I grabbed all the important wood. I, I don't think we have any other in there that we need to grab. Yeah, I have I have one rock on me. I should probably grab more of those. Rocks are also good. You know good. how to turn someone up with the voice chat? Oh, yes. So click V. Go to settings. Mm -hmm. And then click adjust volumes. It's at the bottom. Thank you. Yeah, then you can adjust Solus everybody. Talk. Am I too loud? I'm probably I'm too, too loud, aren't I? Solus is a little quiet. Oh, oh. freaking Solus. Better? Hello? Yeah, we're chilling. I'm just going to turn Solus up a little bit too. There we go. Brilliant. So we're going to go on a little adventure. We're going to get lots and lots of wood, just very briefly, and then we're going to build the fort, and nothing will go wrong. It's not like there's a war happening or anything, am I right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not like the Zora's Domain and the uh, the Sheikah are at war. Wait, I didn't know about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the... Uh, actually, you could you could hop into another boat right now if you want to. Or actually, how about... Also, could you drive me? <laughs> oh, sure. Where are we going? <laughs> uh, so we're going to be just going down the southern coast of Hyrule. And I'll tell you when to stop. There's going to be a ocean encampment that has some horses there with saddles. Uh, I have I have two saddles. One of us will have to walk, though. I have a saddle. You have a saddle. Brilliant. 
So we just need to find you another horse in that case. Mm -hmm. Yes. Brilliant. Okay, let me know if I'm going the wrong way. Oh, there's an anvil right there. Should we take it? No, it's fine. Wait, what? Anvil? What do you mean? Oh, yeah, there's an anvil there. What the? Weird. I heard the iron was valuable, so... Yes, it is. Oh, oh, every shrine, and I believe a lot of the Divine Beasts have uh, have iron... Uh, are, like, sorry, they have anvils at them. I don't know why, but they do. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. That's cool. Oh, it's for the terminals, right? Yes, 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 yes. But I, I don't know why they chose an anvil for that design. I don't know. Maybe it just looks the closest. It, it seems weird to me. Yeah. Am I still heading in the right direction? Yes, you are. I'm not sure why, but my camera keeps wanting to f move to the right. Ah, yeah. well. uh, oh, no, no, no. Turn. Sorry. Sorry. Wrong direction. You do need to take a left. Yeah, we're going left here. Yes. Take a left. We, we, we got we to gotta go on the southern coast. Along the southern coast. Um, a little bit more south. Yeah, good, 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 good. That's it. Keep, keep, keep at it. Keep at it. We, we are, we are rocking it right now. I'll just follow Solus. Yes, follow Solus. He knows where we're going. Solus, you'll need to take a left up ahead. Okay. Are we just going to Luralin? Not quite. We're actually going past Luralin. Uh, Luralin doesn't have much for us, although we could strip it of wood if we wanted to. I, I don't really... I don't really want to do that. I don't want to get people angry in Luralin. That would cause a war on the server just in and of itself. But uh, there's a lot of wood in the jungles around Farron, and I think we should grab that. And then, once we're in the Farron region, we just need to cross the Bridge of Hylia, hop, skip, and a jump. We're in Hyrule Central Field, and we are practically at Lookout Landing. It'll be, it'll be quick. It'll be really fast. Lightning fast, if I do say so myself. Which I do say so myself. Perfect. Yeah. So there is a war that's happening right now. Originally, the Sheikah, the people living in the, the Sheikah village, who lived underneath Sheikah village, declared war on the Gerudo because they stole their stuff. So Gerudo executed one of the Sheikah members, and the Sheikah got really ticked off of that because there was supposed to be a non aggression pact, even though they stole stuff. Uh, so the. Um, they, they intended to blow up Gerudo Town as revenge. That seems to be delayed now. Uh, they were going to call it Jericho Day. Yeah. But now, now it's being delayed. Because when the other server members found out about this, they declared war on the Sheikah, who I am now calling the Yiga because effectively they've gone into hiding and they're performing terrorist attacks, blowing up settlements. <laughs> so they, they are essentially the Yiga now. Uh, so... Mm -hmm. The Yiga are now at war with the Zora and the Gerudo, although the Gerudo seem to be a little bit inactive lately. Maybe that's another place we could claim for ourselves. For you science! Could the, you could get Robrosis Fury if we go to Gerudo. Can we get that? Is that available now? Yeah, I have it. Wait, what? How does that, does it work? Yeah, do you want me to show you? I can show you real quick. Yes, I would love to see how this works. All right. Take Take a break here, guys. This is it. We're almost there, but we, we, we could take a break for this. So you have to take your sword out, crouch. Okay, I take your sword okay, out wait, and wait, crouch. This is a little embarrassing. <laughs> I saw it for it's, a second. Yeah, I saw something. Oh, shoot! Ooh. Holy crap! And it charged oh, all the creepers, creepers too! Charged. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we should Whoops. leave. You dropped your telescope, by the way. Oh, no! Did I? Yeah, it's, it's right in here. the water right oh, here. I picked it up. Oh yeah, how did I how did I drop I must have clicked the wrong button, my bad. My yeah. bad. That's crazy. And thank you for the telescope back. Oh, what oh. the frick? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Those creepers are a little bit more scary than we thought they were. Hey, I got a zombie head though. I didn't even know I could. Why is it what there's there's an enchanted shovel here. It has efficiency three! This is <laughs> sick! I'm taking this. Are you close enough to walk or are you still bedding? I wonder if my stuff keeps falling out for some reason tied to the, uh, this ability. Oh, are you in the back? Oh, I oh, yeah. think so. Because you know how if you hit someone with lightning in Breath of the Wild, it stuns them and drops their weapons? I think yes! that's what that is. That makes so much sense. So it actually causes people to lose whatever they're holding on at the moment. 
holding on to. Cool. So if there's a, a monster with an enchanted bow and you want to see if you can get it, you ought to use Urbosa's Fury. That is so freaking clever. Ah, mm -hmm. I love that. Man, what a strange time to be alive. Oh, it's actually up ahead, just to the right. Uh, okay, you should not have gotten out of the boat. Why did... <laughs> <laughs> it was a misclick, I'm sorry. Get back, get back. Okay, yeah, we, the horses are up area? ahead. In this area right here. Yeah, one of us will have to walk, two of us will get horses. I'll walk until I find a horse. Yeah, I mean, we're going to be stopping in Farron anyway, so we might find one while we're there. Uh, I did not name them, but they are still here. Wait, are we close to Laurelin? Uh, yeah, yeah, we, we, are, we were, but I I, uh, I chose to pass it today. We visited there a few times in previous streams. So it's like, wait, we, we've seen that. We've been there, done that. Are you okay there? Uh, hopefully. Oop. I need to grab my arrows back. I don't have infinite arrows. I have to make these count. Yeah. Aw, look at this guy. He just wants to be a chef. <laughs> Imagine pursuing your dreams. Yeah, so these are both Anyone tamed horses. Hurt? And we're gonna take them. Sounds good. Uh, I have a saddle. Oh, that? that was me. Yeah. I, I, f I found this sick horn. It's, it's, it's like the best. Just a low grumbling noise. Very intimidating. Uh, Solus, uh, do you have a saddle? Sorry, my mom was talking to me. What? <laughs> do you have a saddle? Uh, no, not on me right now. No, but you're the one who's getting the horse. Okay, so I'll give you a saddle. It's on the ground. Get on that horse and let's boogie. Come on, Ozzel, follow behind. Can I uh, jump out of this? Oh, my bad. Slow horse. Or I, I should say, um, uh, vertically challenged horse. Yeah. Yes. It's a vertically challenged horse. My word. Do you ever feel like you can't quite get words out the way that you wish you could? Yeah. Happens all the time. Like, you, you want to say something really cool and intricate, but then when you actually sit down and try and say it, it just doesn't come out that way. Yeah, that happens to me all the time when I'm recording. I just be butchering stuff sometimes. <laughs> yeah, it happens a lot to me. Mm -hmm. I wish I could be as articulate as somebody like Ar Technoblade was. He 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 knew how to talk and play games at the same time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Is there anybody like that that you you think? Oh yeah, they are somebody I wish I could speak like. Um, I don't think so. I don't know. I don't watch very much uh, YouTube, so I wouldn't. I don't know. Eh, hey, well, that's fine. That's fine. I'm sure there's somebody. Now that I mentioned it, it'll be one of those things where you're like, oh yeah. Yeah. I have to. And now I now I can't unsee it. <laughs> that always happens to me. Somebody mentioned something, and now I can't unsee it. You know, red cars are nine percent of the uh, total amount of cars in America. That's a true fact. 9% of cars in America are red. Now you won't be able to unsee it. Almost 10% of cars are red. That's crazy. Just about. Uh, ooh, do we take a left or right here? What are we doing? Yeah, we gotta go straight. I think we wait for his yell, because I don't know where he is. What? Nah, he he's fine. Oziel is the most fine person I know. He's fast. Uh, you know, he, he probably has, has a, a champion's ability that allows him to run faster. Yeah, probably. He yeah. Does. Yeah, come on. Let's, let's go. He'll catch up. That's it's good. Ozzel. Yeah. I mean, he can, he can just stream snipe you if he needs. Yeah, he can or stream. Like he, wait, what? Hmm? Never mind. Oh, look. It's a horse. Well, maybe we should wait for him. There we go. Yeah, yeah, he has a saddle. Once he gets a horse, then all three of us can go at the same pace. Uh, horse, get out of the way. I want to see. I want to see this man come. Here he is. He is coming. Do you is have that a wild the horse? Paraglider? Yes, it is. Oh, I have the paraglider. Okay, I don't yet, so. Oh, yeah, I darn. don't either. Interesting. So one of us has the paraglider, one of us has Urbosa's Fury, and Solus is a speedrunner. All of us have our cool <laughs> thing about us. Perfect. Oh my gosh, one of my viewers had three unskippable ads in a row. Unfortunate. Highly and premium is actually very worth it if you watch a lot of YouTube. Say what? Oh, premium! I. Yeah. If you watch a lot of YouTube, I think it's worth it. 
I am inclined to agree. Although I actually, I got rid of premium, even though I had the student discount. I did it because I was watching too much YouTube. And I think ads are a nice <laughs> buffer to stop you from watching too much. Because you get to a video, it's got a long ad, and you think, mm, is it worth it? Nah, I'm gonna stop. Yeah. That's a, that's a good way of, of cutting back on your YouTube consumption. Not everybody needs that, though. So which which trees are we breaking? Like what? I think we should start right here. This, this is it. Have we gotten Lake Tower yet? Uh, I, don't think I, have I yet. actually I didn't mark it anymore. I deleted all my markers, so I cannot tell you. I originally had a bunch mm -hmm. of markers on my map saying like, "Yep, I've been to this tower and not to that tower," but then when I went to all of them, I, I marked them all as gone to. Mm-hmm. I think, we, I think that was the last one we did. That was not during a stream. That was after a stream. Me and you got together and did that. Yeah. But yeah, gents, this is it. We're going to just mine as much of this as possible and put it in the bread box. Smart. Yes. And then we could strip them later. Hey, guys, what's your favorite champion in the game? Asks Mo Kid. That's a good question. In Tears or Breath of the Wild? Uh... Breath of the Wild. Specifically Breath of the Wild. Uh, hmm. I don't know. Uh, I guess Mipha's Grace is pretty strong. True, That's true. That's so boring. I like Revali. Yeah, Revali's cool. It's better than Tulin. Oh, no, you didn't just say that. Uh, it's Breath of the Wild champions, like, clear every single tier of the Kingdom champion. Absolutely. I don't know how I feel about that. Sidon's really cool. Sidon's useless. What? Like, he doubles your damage if you're using Zora gear. Doubles. Well, just get better weapons. Just get, get a, just get better weapons. That's a huge early game bonus if you go there first. You can get big damage. That's true, I guess. Big damage. But like you have to go find him while you're fighting, and you have to wait for the bubble like after you've used it. Just, I don't know. Too much of a hassle to just even activate them, you know? Yeah, it's annoying, but honestly, their abilities aren't that bad. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not that bad. I, I think Sidon is really cool. It's it's just a free one-hit shield. Riju's cool, too. I agree. Minoru's kind of useless. We'll say Minoru. That. Yeah, I haven't actually gotten Minoru yet. I still need to do that. Oh. It's one of those things where I know what it does, but I, I just haven't, like, wanted to yet. Because I like to leave certain things unfinished so I have new things to look forward to in the game. Hmm. It's kind of a weird philosophy. Like yeah, they're, they're all okay, but getting to them is the annoying part, having to press A on them, so I usually never activate their abilities. I just turn them off. Yeah, like Tulin's blowing ability, I, I usually what I do there is I just turn it on while I'm in mid-air, use it, mm -hmm. and then I put it away. Like it like drinking a, a potion in a game. Yeah, but in my opinion, it should have been like, if you're in air, that's the only time you should be able to activate him. And well, I think you're aiming with a bow. I don't know. That's just me, though. I'm sure it has some a, a practical use, right? There must be some time you need to blow an object in the game. Like, uh... uh does it, does it does it stun enemies? Kind of, it no. just blows them back, if that's what you're saying. There we go, yeah, that, that's good. Just, yeah, I guess so. If they all, like, the wind also blows sand away. You can do that in the lightning temple, which true, is pretty true, cool. True, 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 true. Also, somebody in chat named Swack just pointed out, I am a bipolar person because I said I hated Lookout Landing, and now, look at me. I'm saying we're rebuilding Lookout Landing. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why we're doing it. It's because we got to make it bigger and better than they did. We have to improve on the formula. Show them how it was meant to be done. This is, this is calculated. This is a calculated effort. Hey, how would you guys like to stop at Bunyan Town before we go? AKA Fort Hitano. Sure. It's a little bit out of the way, but it seems like the, pr the mayor wants us to visit. Maybe he has some supplies for us. Or maybe it's an ambush! We're, we're prepared for an ambush, don't worry. 
Yeah, you're right, you're right. I mean, three three strapping gents who are mm -hmm. the most skilled Zelda players in the community, by and far. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nobody, nobody even comes close. Not even close. Oh, collect saplings while you can. We need saplings because uh, there's no trees okay. when we get there. We need to start growing them. Yeah, I have three. That's good. That's good. We'll take that. I have zero. Yeah, because the leaves don't deteriorate on this version. Uh, well, they, 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 they do. It's just the, these trees are fake. Because they're fake trees, the, the leaves do not deteriorate. So we do not get uh, trees and saplings normally. And that also means leaves stay up in the air permanently, which stinks. It's a stanky. Now, are you guys are you guys still alive? No. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. There was an awkward three seconds of silence. I'm American. I'm not supposed. I'm not supposed to be able to accept silence. It just I don't know. Listening to you talk just feels like watching YouTube. It feels like <laughs> watching YouTube. Listening to me talk feels like YouTube. I wish. I wish, but I, I am more articulate in the shower when I am thinking of ideas about things to talk about than when I'm actually on stream. Ooh, I agree, honestly. I do the same thing. Yeah, you go in the shower and you think like, hmm, what's a question I would answer in a future stream, potentially, or a future video? Yeah. And then you just, you just start rehearsing it. Yeah. My parents look at me like I'm crazy when I do that. So I've just started telling them, <laughs> I'm rehearsing. I'm not. I'm not really. I'm just, I'm just practicing talking. Because it's hard. Talking Especially is the hardest. Of the camera. Yes. How was your personal experience in the lockout yesterday? Oh, I had a blast. Okay, so anybody who doesn't know in my, my chat, uh, the lockout challenge is a challenge where you get a, a large bingo board of challenges in Tears of the Kingdom, and you have to complete a certain amount of them to win. In this case, it was 13. Uh, and me and a bunch of other people last night did it. If, in EST time, it was like 7 o'clock, so some people couldn't make it. But we, I had a blast. I was working with uh, Justin Bay, uh, a speedrunner named Sirius, and... Oof. Timber. Who was Timber, thank you. It was Timber was the last one. Yeah, and Tim, Timber, he, he was pulling our team because he's the glitch expert. He knew exactly where to find everything. It was <laughs> nuts. Uh, but yeah, I had a blast. I, I think one thing I need to fix, though, is my audio issues. Holy cow! I did awful. That's the, that's the worst stream in terms of audio I have ever done. My Welcome. cousin, he rarely met, he talks when he watches my videos, but he was listening to them yesterday uh, while, while having dinner. And he had to text me. He's like, yo, what's wrong with your audio today? And I couldn't fix it during the stream because I was in the middle of the challenge. You know, there's, there's no time to sit down yeah. and fix that. Um, yeah, it, it came you know down to two wrong. things. Uh, what was wrong? Yeah, it came down to two things. Number one, I was I was muting myself occasionally, but not muting the other people in the chat with me. So they would keep talking about strategy, and I would try and talk to chat about something else, and it was just me talking over them in the audio recording. It, it sounded bad. Mm -hmm. The second thing is the audio from the game was one second behind. Oh. That's the worst. Yeah, you can, you can save yourself if you do make a lot of mistakes, but delayed audio like that, mm -hmm. that's game over. Yeah, especially if it's on the same audio track. I agree. Yeah, and it's all the same audio track. You can't fix it. Mm -hmm. Oh, somebody said they made brownies. Chompy Chomp. Congratulations. I love brownies. They're like a cousin of bread. Oh, and in case anybody's curious, uh, I did not win the challenge. I lost because the other team, team cheated. They must what? have. There's no other way they could have won. Right, Ozzel? Yes. I am an innocent man. We did not cheat. Solus was there the whole stream. I think it was nepotism because Ozzel was the one who ran the whole challenge. <laughs> he rigged it. He, he rigged it. <laughs> what? Ozzel looked at our team and he said, yeah. We can just we can just fake it. We'll fake the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> they don't deserve to win. Maybe he was just intimidated by you and your teammates. I, I was would a be a little intimidated by your team. I can't lie. I would. I be. knew Timber was a beast. And you know, I I invented a speed run, so 
Oh, I'm yeah, kind of a pro speedrunner. Oh. Yeah. With, with a lot of help from other people who actually did all the ki the heavy lifting, but but I inspired the idea. Exactly. In fact, I think the bread percent speedrun, the whole idea of it came during one of your speedruns, right, Solus? Yeah, probably. We were in a live stream. Well. Yeah, you were in a live stream. Um, and I said, speedrun getting bread. And you said, actually, sure, we could turn that into a speedrun. And I, I was I was frazzled out of this. I'm like, there's no way. You can't just make a speed run. But then after like two minutes of explaining it, you're like, yeah, you can do that. It's that easy. Yeah. I was blown away. You just you just need to get, what was it, like five people to do the run and it's official? Yeah, basically. Absolutely insane. Get it popular enough, you know. That was yeah. fun. I still find new people doing bread percent uh, after all these years. I mean, they did it years ago, but I find their videos now. Mm-hmm. And there will be a Tears of the Kingdom one, mark my words. That could be fun. We'll probably up the ante, though, by making it that you have to get both types of bread. Are there two? I didn't know that. Yeah, cheesy bread. Oh, oh yeah, cheesy bread. You didn't know that? Yeah, there's cheesy bread. So the strat in that one would be you have to either go to Hateno first to get the cheese, or you need to go to, uh, to Bantha first to get the wheat. But either way, you do have to go to those two locations. Yeah. Yeah, unless there's a cheaper way of getting wheat. Is there is there wheat anywhere else in the world? I'm not sure. I don't think so. I if, think it's, yeah, I think it's only if I there. if I end up learning the any percent round for Skyland, I will speed run bread percent for Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah. Uh, one thing I think would be interesting though is changing the ruling. So instead of it being you have to bake bread, it's just you have to obtain both types of bread. So there could be like. Ah, and this might be a bad idea, but there could be like the very off chance that you are able to. Oh gosh, you guys are gone. They reset the server. One moment. Yeah. Uh, we were in the middle of collecting wood, by the way. Somebody was asking what we were doing. We were in the middle of collecting wood so we can make lookout landing because we don't got the goods. We don't have any, we don't even have the goods yet. We gotta find the goods. Omega Dan Kong says, Did you know that there is bread in all Zelda games? Uh, Omega Dan Kong, I hate to break it to you, but there is not. There is not. Yes. You need, need to make a video with the pre-stream doodles, says Tyler Bryant. I I definitely could. <laughs> I, 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 you mean like an entire stream of just doodles? Maybe someday. Maybe someday. Um, Omega Dan Kong, there is not bread in every Zelda game. Zelda 1 doesn't have bread, Zelda 2 doesn't have bread, Zelda 3 doesn't have bread, Zelda 4 doesn't have bread, that's a Link's Awakening. It's not until Minish Cap that we got our first instance of bread in a Zelda game. Uh, although, in Link's Awakening HD version, they arguably might have added it as a, a decoration in one of the houses. We don't know yet. Server's back, sweet. Oh, and in case you guys don't know, yeah, Ozil is a YouTuber. You should check out his channel. Both Ozil and Solus Hello. are YouTubers. Okay, I'm back. So, um, what did I miss? Where was I? What, what was I talking about? Ozil, Ozil, what was I talking about? Um, bread in Zelda. Yes! Yes! Not every single Zelda game has bread. That's not Go what back. I was talking about. What was it? Hello? What was I talking about, Solus? I have no idea. I'm sorry. Do you want me to <sighs> go back and see? No, no. <laughs> it's, we, the moment is lost. Yeah. It is lost. But I what think we're I close to having enough. How much more do you think we need? I thought we were going to be able to fill this thing up immediately, but it's taken a, a little bit longer. Let's put saplings in here, too. Yeah. We're almost there. We're almost I there. Think... Yeah. Maybe we just make our way there and plant stuff around it so we just, you know? Yeah, so we could get a head start. I like that idea. And I have bone meal. I have a oh, stack of true. bones, so we, oh, we are set. Oh? I, Yo, found... bone collection! Yes! I love bones. Here's, here's two more. Right Yo! More for the bone collection! Someday I want to just make a bone collection on a server and see how many bones I can get. Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay, let's go. We break camp! Immediately! 
be. Oh, guys, Celio Spring is in my chat. Wow. Oh, Whoops. Sorry. What are, you, what are you like getting some pent up aggression out over Celio Spring? Nah, man. Oh, I say like Celio Spring is here, you know. Punch is bread. <laughs> Slash drop kicks. Celios, we need to have you on here sometime at the same time as me. We gotta Where did do my that. Horse go? Black oh, where did my horse go? I think Brett is on my horse, so I'll just take his. I, I didn't pay attention to which horse was which. Uh, have we all found a horse? Um, There's one over yeah. there. Oslo's got one. White one. Was there not? was another black spotted one, I believe. Yeah. I mean, if I'm not wrong, I think he went back. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta find it. I'm gonna check over the hill. It's around here somewhere, I'm sure of it. Ah, oh, man, this is such a nice spot. This is where they had horses. Well, apologies. This is where they had horses in the E3 2014 trailer for Breath of the Wild. But at the time, we only knew of it at Zelda U. This spot right here, I vi vividly remember it. Or maybe, maybe it wasn't that there were horses there, but we were riding a horse through the location. There was a horse involved. It was really great. Maybe I don't vividly remember it, but it was, it was fun. Oh, we both have it. They all have it. Great. Yep. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Sweet. Taloka Landing. Uh, let me oh. let me play my adventure music. I need... I need a... Yes. Ha ha. Is it going to be an accurate lookout landing or is it going to be a, a defendable lookout oh, landing? Oh, oh, it's going to be defendable. We're going to make a way, way better lookout landing. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good plan. Oh, Celio Spring can't join us uh, because he is going to bed at noon. Sense. He's asleep. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He's. Uh, he's he needs that sleep. <laughs> noon. Are our for are, are our horses that much faster? Maybe. Is your horse slow as you, or are you just waiting? Oh, I was collecting some flowers. Oh, you know, look at Lenny could use some decorations. Yeah, yeah, decorations. Yes. Mm -hmm. Celio Spring is nuts. I, I, at one point, he was just freaking nocturnal. He would wake up at five in the afternoon and go to sleep at five in the morning. That was how he explained it to me. <laughs> how do you? I mean, I he lives in Alaska, Celio. so it's excusable. But like, how do you live like that? I was gonna say Alaskans have really weird sun stuff. Yeah, yeah this is weird. just built like that. He's built different. <laughs> yeah, he's impressive. I'll give him that. Yep. Oh yeah. I forgot to get the lake tower. I'm throwing. Oh, he woke up at 6 p.m. yesterday. Mm. Okay. Hey. Good for you. Got a little bit of sleeping in. <laughs> you said we were gonna visit Fort Hateno on the way, or? Oh gosh! Thing? Thank you for reminding me. Yes, we need to do that. Fort Hitano, uh, we need to take a right up ahead. Yep. And also, if you see any eggs, collect those. I, I think we should add some chickens to the fort. They're a nice piece of livestock that we could easily spread. And that would give us uh, the feathers for bows and arrows. Let's just keep going. He'll catch up. Yeah. It's all good. Go to this shrine. Bosch Kala, go to shrine. Oh, what does this one have in it? It's the wind one. You know, wind. Oh yes, that's a that's a nice easy one. Mm -hmm. Very quick. Yeah. But smooth, right? Yeah. There's... Oh, there's a skeleton head over there. Do you want that? Uh, sure. We could put it up on a pike as a way of threatening our enemies. Perfect. Good. This will intimidate our foes. Intimidation. Okay. <clears throat> Grazi has asked me to give a lesson on tires, so I'm going to have to get the proper music assembled. Here we go. Uh, so. You mean Celios. What did I say? Grazi. Oh my Grazi. goodness, yeah, it's Celios. I'm. Guys, my, I'm not Technoblade. My brain can't work that fast. What do you expect me to do? Live stream properly? Like a, like a decently comprehensible human being? I can't do that. I can't do that. No, here's a lesson on tires. So the, um,. Michelin Tire Guy. You guys know the Michelin Tire Guy? Yeah, the marshmallow-looking dude. Yeah. The, the marshmallow-looking dude. He's in the uh, the Ghostbusters movie. Yeah. Yeah. 
he is white. Like, he, he is a white marshmallow man. Do you know why he is white instead of black when he's supposed to represent a tire company? Because Michelin started question. using white rim, white rim tires? Is that what they're called? Yeah, yeah. Originally, they used white rim trier, tires because of where the rubber came from. It came from a tree, and then eventually they made it black. Uh, probably because they found a cheaper alternative. I don't know the exact reason. So that's why he was white. Yeah. Kind of strange. Oh, oh, the Michelin tires. Um, they, they have another interesting piece of history to them, too. Correct me if I'm wrong in the chat, but they were the ones who did the Michelin rank rating system for the uh, restaurants and locations that you visit, right? They did that as a way to encourage more people to get on the road so that they would need more tires. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Michelin stars. White rims also just get way dirtier. Yeah, actually, that's a good point. Sly, Sly is probably right that it's just, yeah, it's, it's just that they got stained, so maybe black was a better color. Yeah. Oh, oh Michelin's words. Oh, interesting. Where did my axe go? Maybe um, my Michelin axe. stars were originally <laughs> sorry. as your uh, as your guide tour for French restaurants. They were sold with cars. Oh, interesting! They actually sold it with the car. A guide to French restaurants. Huh. Hey, sorry, good, good, good stuff. I don't know tires very well. I, I'm knowing this like through the grapevine of the internet. Uh, but mm -hmm. good stuff, good stuff. Tires can be interesting. You know the Guinness Beer Company and the Guinness Book of World Records are by the same guy? Oh, really? The beer yeah. company is the one that does the Guinness Book of World Records. Huh. Mm -hmm. The more you know. Yeah. I, I did not know that. Pretty cool coincidence. Or I guess not coincidence. No, not... A, yeah, it's probably a, a business thing. Like, Connection. If you run the company that says what the best things in the world are... Then you can say your drink Should is the best in the world. Tower, real quick. Might as well, right? If you'd like to, to. I already, I've already done all of them, but I'll, I'll sit back and watch this. All right. all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck, gents. I'm taking my horse over here. Yeah, yeah. Good idea. I'll, I'll watch the other horse. We'll no, watch it very, guy. extremely diligently. And meanwhile, I'm gonna play very overly dramatic music. Assuming that one person is gonna die. Look at that man go. There he goes. Wearing blue. Coming up on the left side. Left flank. He just killed something. I don't know. If he, I don't even know what he killed. Going past the campfire. Approaching the tower. There's a big cliff right up ahead. What is he going to do? He is analyzing his options. Rivali's Gale. Classy maneuver. Let's check up on the other guy. Cannot see him from this angle. He's probably approaching from the back side. Slowly gaining altitude. Yep, yep, yep. Um, Rivali's Gale did not work for him. There was a bug. Oh, no. He's readjusting, reevaluating, going down, trying to get to the bottom without taking too much fall damage. Where's our other friend? Where did he go? His horse is looking on with, with desperate emotions. I think the horse is freaked out by the fact his master may not return. Where'd Solus go? Oh, they're both gone. They're both both at the tower. Oh, 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 we got confirmation. What was that? Solus is bridging up with blocks. He's bridging up with blocks. He's halfway there. The other one, I can't see him. Where, where's Ozil? I don't see Ozil. I have no confirmation on his location. Somebody in chat asked me what song we're playing. We're playing the Pirate's Fortress theme from the Zereo uh, Zelda Majora's Mask remaster. That was a lot of words. This horse is freaking out. It's drowning. No! Uh, I also see a wood bridge there. Maybe somebody just built that. That might be. That might have been what Oswald was using to get up. Did they make it? Did they make it? They should be done by now. Ah, oh, crap. I don't see them. I don't hear anything. This might be the end of our dear friends. No! They survived! Solus makes a 10 out of 10 landing in the water. Where's Where's our other friend? Where's Ozil? Ozzel dies with grace. And the crowd goes wild. Oh, 
Solus saving his horse, but actually submerging it deeper in water. Horse comes up for air. Starts flailing in water. Dangerously. Oh no! It's like quicksand! Ozzel on the straightaway, almost back, swimming across the river, leaving his horse here seems to have been the go-to strategy. But will he be able to actually reach his horse before Solus comes to the other side with his? It's neck and neck. Ozzel almost able to reach his. It's right here. Yes, Ozzel wins. No. And that's how it goes. That's how it goes, baby. Sometimes, sometimes the game is rigged from the start. <laughs> Fallout reference, let's go! I love Fallout. Fallout is fun. Not appropriate for this channel, but I enjoy it. Let's go! See, they're making a Fallout show on Amazon. Oh, yes, I did! They're making a Fallout show on Amazon. Yeah. Would we like some banners for the third landing? Uh, oh, yeah, right. sure, let's grab them. I have a few red banners back at the base, but I didn't bring them. One person should hold on to the banner so we're not being inefficient with our inventory. Could we put it in the... I have some things I can put in the shulker box. I'm kind of full. Okay. Hey, that's a good idea. Let me... Let me get the shulker box out. Boom. We're dropping banners left and right, boys. What's happening? We are... I don't know. I guess we're just inept. <laughs> Sorry, I had no inventory space. Oh my gosh, Ozzel, the judges just came in. They have disqualified you from ra the race because you died. And they oh, say yeah, I fell on the dead, tower so I get my dead back. people are incapable of winning races. Ooh. Oh my one, goodness, Solus is the winner. Let's go. I love you, chat. Unbelievable. Who could have seen that coming? Great judges. Great judges. judges. Great judges. Thank you, chat, for helping us judge that one. I like that you can use it in the middle of me trying to break it. Yeah. While standing on it with a horse. All right, let's go. It's not too far away. Uh, the the, the yeah. fort that we're going to will hopefully have the mayor there waiting for us so we can get some supplies. And then we'll build Lookout Landing. Perfect. But hey, how are y'all's weeks? Oh, wait, Ozzel's way behind. Ozzel! This horse is pretty slow. <laughs> That's the one Brett had earlier. How was your week? Good. Well, that's good. Um, because you said it was, was good, so it was good. Was there anything else? Um, you were talking about something with a bowl yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This morning I had to corral a bull. Well, technically it's a steer. It's not a bull. There is a difference. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I said bull, but I meant steer. Uh, we were we were corralling a steer into a truck so that it could be taken away to meat land, where it meets all other sorts of animals and becomes meat. Nice. Isn't that nice? That's so sweet. Yeah. Now, the difference between a steer and a bull is that a bull is uh, not castrated. A steer is castrated. And yeah, you, 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 you do that so that they're less aggressive. It ends up being good for the farm and all the female cows if you uh, castrate the males every once in a while. Just a few of them. Yeah. Or most of them. Because my farm uh, is also a beef farm. Oh, cool. They, I didn't know that. Did I know that? Yeah, they... I'm not sure. I don't know. I guess not. But they they used to just, like, trade bull. Like, there'd be a bull that would just go around every once in a while. Did they... <laughs> Yes, one bull. <laughs> like they trade between farms, you know? We have that on my hill. There's one bull that we transfer between all of the farms. We call him Patrick. He's a big, nasty bull. We just transfer him between farms, and that's how we have n baby cows on all the properties. Yeah. That's ah, they're crazy. here! I got it. I, it's, hello. Hello there. Yeah, look out. The chickens are very noisy. Oh my gosh! Uh... Yeah, yeah, there's just Do you mind if little... I take some eggs? There's so many! Uh, no, literally just take as many eggs as you want. Okay, thank you. Also, if you guys are gonna... How do you live with the smell? Food, uh, I, I tried to go around, around them, actually. Yeah, and then I... Did you know, when I tried to breed them, there's actually so many in one spot that they die of entity cramming. So they sort of naturally, like, keep their population in check. It's very nice. Wow. 
How do we get so, out of here? Yeah. Uh, we don't. I think we're stuck here, Rosal. Oh, I have. Oh, oh yeah. Here, you eggs. can go through the yeah, gate, or you can go here. Here, let me show you secret. Secret. So this is a secret route they used to oh, escape. Oh, speed running route. Yeah. Exactly. Speed running route. So yeah, this is like for Hiteno, right? Yes. Uh, there's some stuff like half the walls are like hollow, and I put a bunch of um, Holy moly. horses in there. So that that's where I keep like half my horses. Uh, because I have been breeding horses for a while now. This is a lot. Oh, also, here, wait, let me grab something. Holy moly. Shh, don't Thank tell you. him, I'm gonna go grab some bread. There's a pillager in the here. Oh, yeah, don't, don't, that's, that's Gerald. Don't, don't mess with Gerald. Gerald? Who's Gerald? The pillager. Oh, the here you go. pillager? Oh, that was, yeah, here, you can have some of that bread. Yeah, there's a pillager oh, yes. in the boat. If you wanted feathers for air birds, there's some. And then also, if you're going to make lookout landing, it's very much made of wood, so you might want some of these saplings. Oh, yes, this thank you. Useful. This is awesome. Yeah, so you yeah. You can plant those, yeah, and then you should get some more spurs. Yes. Or you can plant four and make the tall ones, but if you do that, be warned that uh, they're going to make a bunch of podzel because they turn the grass around them into podzel. Ah, okay. That's a good. That's a good tip to know. Yes. Yeah, and then you can harvest any of the fields here if you want. Just like replant them. I don't think they're all fully grown. Don't yet. mind if I do. Oh, so. Yeah. Do not mind if I do. But my lanta. How? Yeah, this is insane. This is quite the operation you have here. Oh, oh my gosh, there's even more stuff. Cause, oh yeah, there's like so I'm making some big fields out front and then. Because the wheat turns into hay bales, which I can use to age the horses, and then the carrots back there are for making golden carrots for the horses, and ah. uh, yeah, most of it's for the horses, because I've been working, I got like um, a horse that's like 0 .001 away from the max speed, or no, sorry, 0 .01. Yeah, uh, it seems like a few people on the, the server speed. are getting those fast horses now. Yeah, they've all been coming from here. <laughs> You are you uh, are literally like, yeah, the Lon Lon you... Ranch of the server. Yes, yes, we are. Uh, if you come over to the to the horse corner, there's like um, there's a bunch back here in the breeding pen, and then there's a bunch in the actual like breeding pen wall. Yeah. Oh yeah, over here. Look at that, huh? So cool. Yeah. There's a breeding pen, and then inside the walls, yeah. there's like a few more that are just wow. for storage. Wow. Left him, bro. I got scared. Quite the operation you have here. You wanna harvest some? Look at yeah. that. There's even an inside to these walls. Oh, yeah. That's cool. I didn't know there was an upper floor to this. Did you make that? Oh, there was, there, most of this wasn't, yeah, I built pretty much, the inside was just like a uh, normal like stone, and so I dug it out to store some horses. Ah, oh, nice. Hey, way to be resourceful. Yeah. Hmm, yes. Zelda would be proud. Also, the, don't, don't go to the top of the wall or you're gonna get shot at. Um, by the pillager? There's some guards up there. You have yeah. a crafting table? Yeah, there's a few. If you look in some of the houses, they should be crafting table. Use this for me. Thank you. I kind of want to see this. Oof! Yeah. Well, you could always oh, make him non hostile. Bread. They run out of arrows eventually. Oh, yeah, they run yeah, out yeah, of Yeah, that's bows. what I'm yeah. gonna do. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm basically God. I won't. I won't explain why right now, because it's it's my it's my trade secret. But I'm basically God right now, uh, so I can just stand here and get shot. What? Um, yeah. Shh, don't ask. Don't ask. Um, but yeah. So that's what you I have did with another one. But then he accidentally died. I have superpowers. Yeah. It's kind of weird. I don't know how it happened. I think I'm the main character now. Uh, anyway, <laughs> that happened here, in another some, server like, I was in. I was in a different server yeah, with Celio Spring, and I ended up getting the invincibility modifier, where it's just like, oh yeah, you you absorb all damage, 100%. I just Here, became a policeman on the each, server. Holy wow! Uh, each hay bale should wow. turn into three bread. So, if you want that, you can have that as well. Red, we have a hay bale in the shulker box. You what? We have a hay bale in the short shulker box if you want to put yes, it in Yes, 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 yes. Good idea, good idea. Oh, this is great. This is great. Pirating this place was a great idea. And it, it ended up being far less violent right. than I thought it would be. Oh, and Sledge, mm, could yeah. I get a hoe? I accidentally 
Or I think that. Um, I only have like. I, only, I just have like one billion stone hoes. <laughs> Here, wait, let's just see. Here we go. Thank you. Yep. Now, now, I gotta ask, as the main character, how how are you gonna be challenged in combat if I don't you know, have I don't know. invincibility? Yeah. It's kind of weird, because, like, I literally, yeah, I don't know, it's going to be very interesting. I'm kind of keeping it on the down low for now, because I want to see if I can get into an actual combat situation normally, and if I'll, like, actually die or not, because, and also, I have to take off my armor whenever I know I'm going to take a lot of damage, because it just damages my armor a bunch, and yeah. it's annoying. And then but that, that reveals your secret if yeah. you do that. I do, I do, yeah. Huh. Now, what about the, the Yiga clan? That's been, you know, roaming around. The Yiga clan? I don't know. There's a bunch of, like, terrorists, I think. So, yeah. They're kind of confusing me. I thought they were going to do something, like, this weekend. But, like, Grazi has not been on. And neither is Helios. And those people were, like, going to stop it or something. So, I'm, I don't know. I talked to... Mm -hmm. I talked to Mighty and Voxel the other day. And they explained what was going on. Apparently, they want to, like, uh, blow up Gerudo Town, I think. So... Hey, no, 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 don't don't put water in the fields. Who's putting water in the fields? Yeah, uh... You're ruining that might... my perfect field. <laughs> they were drying up. You yeah, don't put water in the fields. Up. It's okay. They still grow. They just grow, like, very slightly slower. It doesn't matter. Sorry, slightly slower? Which... Yeah, they literally grow, like, just a tiny bit slower. It's I'm really funny. I'm pretty sure it's more like, than... Oh, we need to irrigate the fields. I'm pretty no, sure it's, it's more... No, it's actually in-plus once you have, like... But then, but then it's, like, really field. hard to stand on them, because they break all the time. Right? No, they they break. No, it's completely normal. It's just they grow slightly slower. That's and then it? they get hydrated when it rains too. Anyway, yeah, that's why I don't understand. I think it looks better without having a bunch of water spots everywhere. But like everyone puts them there, and I, it's like oh. I don't know. It's very strange. Good life hack. They'll go away because like if you take away the wheat on it, then it'll turn back into dirt in a little bit. But it'll if you put the seed back on before it turns yeah. back into dirt, it'll. Just that's grow the thing. It, it's you can't do uh, all of the wheat at once. You have to do it one at a time. Otherwise, they're gonna start going away really quickly. Oh, well, I just take an extra hoe and then just fix it. As oh, go. okay. It's really, it's not as you're going. Hole. I see. Yeah. I just don't like having water. So or either that or I'll like hide water under it. But that's annoying if you're doing like a really big field. So yeah. yeah. Or to just do. Yeah. yeah, interesting. So don't worry about water. I'm going to keep that in mind. Oh. He's gone. Hey, he's oh, back. Might have been chat kicked. He's back. Yeah, probably that's true. Yeah, probably was chat kicked. That happens. Far, <laughs> far more than it should on this server. Yeah. Hey, I think that's everything we need to talk about and grab from here, right? Yeah. Thank you so much for the help, Sly. Thank yes. you. Good luck with uh, good luck here. with lookout landing. Oh, before we go though, I, uh, I gotta ask, yeah. why why do you call it why do you call it Bunyan Town? It's um. <laughs> It's actually very, it's very, uh, histo it's a historical name for, uh, the, the plentiful wheat in the region, which was used to make, uh, bread also referred to as a bunion. What? There's a specific, uh, there's a specific loaf of bread, kind of bread making thing that's called a bunion. Nah, you're kidding. Nope, look it up. Okay, um, bunion bread? Look up bunion, like, baking. Bunyan. Okay, baking. Yeah, ignore the foot things. There's a lot of foot things here. There's a lot of foot things, but it doesn't have to do with the foot thing. Okay, etymology of bunion. Me. Small, slightly sweetened roll or biscuit. Uh, of yeah. obscure and much disputed origin, perhaps from the old French word buginette or fritter. Y yes. Yeah, interesting. Huh. It also comes from the Germanic word uh, bungay. Bunion, bungay, uh, for clawed or lump. Huh. Yes. Interesting. I had absolutely no idea. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. History. Yep. Well, hey, thank you for teaching us that. Yeah. Yes, of course. Science. Oh, wait, wait, can I see? Can I check your horse's stats real quick? Yeah, sure. Okay. Oh, who has the red bread box? Oswald, do you have it? I do. Sorry. Good. I was sneezing. That's fine. Okay, interesting. Yeah. All right, well, good luck with... Um, the t Bread, do you need a horse? Uh, I had a horse a second ago. It's over here. 
It's over here. <laughs> you want a faster one? Uh, I think I'll stick with this one. Garlic is pretty good as a horse. All right. All right. Well, yeah. All right. Thank you, Sledge. Yeah, yeah thank you horse. so much. Farewell. Adios. Horns are so cool in this game. Man, I love horns. Okay, so is there a quicker way we could get there? Maybe we could go through Kakariko as a shortcut. Ah, uh, oh, sorry, can't hear you. You're too far away. Onward! To adventure! Yes, it is adventure time. Thank you for admitting as much, Wee Monkey. By the way, Wee Monkey, are you streaming this week or no? I must ask. I must know the answer. You do. You normally do uh, streams on your week on the weekends, but you did just come off of a really long streaming series. They'll be here eventually. They'll be here eventually. There they are. There they are. Mandy, Manda says hi. Hi, Manda. Nice to see you. Oh yes, yes, Wee Monkey too. You did tell me that you got Wi-Fi issues right now, so you can't stream. That makes sense. Guys, pay your respects to Hestu and his green bean cousin. Oh my goodness. I watch out for the berry bush. Do not engage with the berry bush. The berry bush is evil. Wait, where is this guy? The berry bush eat him? I think the berry bush got him. We gotta go without him. You know, there is the Yiga clan old hideout over here somewhere. Should we raid it? Well, the, I was told by the Yiga clan before I broke off my ties with them that I really shouldn't go in there. We should. A pen, well, they moved all their stuff and they, they they made it sound like something bad had happened. Where was it? I'm just, we're just where was it? Ah, uh, it was somewhere on one of these hills. I'm not sure I could That's tell you which one Particular. Hey, maybe this one? I'm gonna try seeing if it's over here. It might very well be that somebody's gone to it already. Yeah, I thought it was like over here. What are we looking for? Well, the, the Yiga clan used to have its hideout over here, but I don't really want to go in there. I'm pretty sure it's booby. Ah, this is it. You know what? You only live once. Uh, no, no, space. we're fine. No, I don't feel good about this. There's no one in here. Yeah, no one's online. We're fine. This is also where they hid, hid that chicken called Gricken for a while. Gricken. I need a water bucket. Uh, guy, guys, I, I don't, I don't think this seems like a safe idea. This, this seems really fishy. It looks like it's been like blown up. Yeah, this is boring. Well, this is the first part of the base. They have multiple parts? Um, yeah, there's a... Where is it? Would you like your bread, bo bread box back? It's not down here. There is a... Oh, thank you. This is it. I believe down this way, they had a mine cart that led down here to the other part of the base. Wait, I heard a dog. I'm sorry, that a dog? dog? That was mine. <laughs> <laughs> IRL dog. Oh, in real life? It sounded yeah. exactly like a Minecraft one. Yeah. Mine Minecraft dog cameo. In real life. Mm -hmm. Just throw those away. You think you left anything valuable? I'm Doesn't gonna guess like no. There's a horse named Gralion. Oh wait, that's Grazzy's horse. What? Do either of you have a saddle? I can uh, take the saddle from my horse. He's pretty slow. How are we gonna get Gralion out of here? He has a lot of health. Do we just build him We could take him out. Do you want to? Yeah, let's try taking Gralion out. Let's save Gralion. Uh, I have some blocks I could use. Okay, I only have sand. <laughs> yes. We'll use this. I'll go get my saddle. Since I think my horse is actually the slowest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go get your horse. Crazy. I guess we don't really need the dramatic music. It doesn't seem like there really is that much going on here. Oh, Solus is going down there. I guess we'll investigate what he's doing. Hopefully he stays safe. 
Oh, how was the geography of this world made? Was it all by hand? We Monkey, yeah, it was made. Well, it was made with a computer first, so that's how the altitudes were made. All the designs and such, that was made by hand. All, all the buildings, all the structures, all the bridges, all the fancier stuff, that was done by hand. Not by me, but by the uh, server owners. Grazzy. Grazzy's his name. map is insane. Um. Vacate his cave? Yeah. Dude, I want peace. cave. Since you've proved unable okay. to accept that, we'll see you on. Did you press that button? Yeah. Don't don't press anything. My fault. I I I don't want to die. Yeah, I I'm too young to die. <laughs> Is this place? Do you see the mini map? I don't have the mini map that shows me caves. Oh, this is crazy. Uh, let, let, yeah, be be very careful around here. This place is There's scary. Like rows of things over here. Oh wait, careful about that villager. Hover your name over. Magda. Magda is a very special villager because um, Magda in Breath of the Wild is the one that if you step on her flowers, she oh. makes you set go back. She's fl flower blight, and in this yeah. in this map. They have a plug-in that means that if you step on one of her flowers, you automatically get transported to where she is, and she kills you. Hello, oh, yeah, hello, hello. That. Yeah, so uh, careful Whoa. around her. She's she's dangerous. The farming here. They had they had it set up so that they could. Oh oh, hey Azul. Hello. I took I got two saddles. I found them on a skeleton. Wait a minute. This is a Jolly Roger. The only way to get this design is with a wither skull. They use the wither skull to get the banner pattern. And we should take the banner, it's pretty valuable. Yeah, we should. We should absolutely take that. Here, I, uh, I can hold on. You got it? I think they have I got it. Farms you got it, good. Oh, wow, this is a huge cave. Holy moly, what is this? Oh, yeah, this place is giant. I can't, is that a not the biggest part. It's Do so not press thing. that. Do, there's, this place has got to be booby trapped to heck. I'm sure of it. No, look at look, come over here, come over here. There's but that's a, strange. They used game. their they used their skull for the banner. They didn't save it, on the off chance they could make a wither. What are they doing there? Oh, there's a mob spawner right here. Yeah. No wheat. Oh, there's a bunch of there's carrots and armors and bow here. Interesting. Yeah. The old yeast. Oh, this was a huge yeah. cave. It was. I think they mined out a lot of it themselves. We could take some of these torches now since it's vacant. I, I suppose so. Ore. There's emerald ore down here. Hey, take that. That's good. I'll leave like one or two so none spawn while we're down here. Yeah. Or I'll leave, sorry. I can't speak English. Oh, is that gold? Hmm. Well, I, I like gold. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is good. This is the goods. What? Found some gold. Nice. Yeah, gold baby. Uh, wait, where is it? It's not in my inventory. No, you have it, I don't you? It's down here. Yeah, it's down here. On the floor. There we go. Paragliders, so handy. This place is gonna be stacked. Hold. On. Yes. Very stacked. I think that's gonna be all for now. Let's uh oh wait. Oh that's just that's just grass seeds. Never mind. I think I think we should get out of here. There's a bigger okay. tunnel. That doesn't make me feel more comfortable. <laughs> wait, there's a huge Huge Let's tunnel? Go. That thing wait. Hold up. I need to Oh wait, this. bread. What? The the mob spawner is spawning creepers. Didn't we? Didn't don't we need gunpowder? Do we need gunpowder? Why would we need gun? What? I thought we were blowing something up. That's oh no, we're not blowing something up. The Yiga clan was going to. Oh okay okay. Although if you want to take supplies from here, that'd be a good idea. Uh, this would be a great way of getting arrows too if we wanted to farm that. But I I can't be bothered. You could make a fully restored bow if you craft all of them together. True. That's a lot of experience, though. You would need a lot of experience to pull that off. No, no, no. Like you just put it in your inventory. A lot of in the four squares in your inventory, it works. 
Oh, I see. Yeah, a fully repaired one. I don't need that, though. I have a flame unbreaking power bow ready. I have a good one. Oh, cool, cool. Yeah, it's it's uh, pretty lit. I don't have a lot of arrows for it, though. But thankfully, Solus was just saying that he has arrows. So I think that we're all good. Yeah, I, th I, think, yeah. I think we're fine. How many arrows do I have, actually? Uh, 36. Oh, we're, we're getting more now. The numbers are going up. Yeah, I think I think we're done here. Let's okay. let's take these torches and get out of here. I don't want to stay here any longer than I have to. But that's very ominous. The fact that they actually used their they actually used their um, uh, wither skull that they owned in order to make a banner. They were not going to let me make a banner with it, but they did themselves. Uh, guys, are you all right? Yeah, I was just looking at this villager's trades. Oh, that's... Oh, yeah, she has trades. Huh. You did find emeralds, right? Yes. And what? we can turn wheat into emeralds? Dude, that tunnel is so boring. Well, I can't give them wheat. I'm not going to give them wheat. <laughs> that's outrageous. Fair enough. That's outrageous. But hey, cookies. You can't get cookies anywhere else on the server unless you find cocoa beans somehow from a wandering tra trader. Cookies are a valuable resource. And I don't believe there's any watermelon either, so glistening... Glistering, gl glistering watermelon slices. Hey, that's that's powerful. That is powerful as heck. But anyways, yeah, I'm getting out of here. I'm done. This is not a safe location. You two can die down there. I will not. Are we, are we taking uh, Guys' horse? Yeah, I'm stealing it. <laughs> the Gralian? Yeah, we're gonna steal the Gralian. Yeah. Is, was Grazzy part of the Yig clan? No, they that? stole it. Oh. Uh. And then in their attempt to try and escape as fast as possible, it looks like they left it behind. I'm surprised they didn't booby trap I'll, I'll, it. I'll give the horse a better home. Yeah. Yes. He's a rescue horse. <laughs> yeah. And the arms of the angels. Living down here must suck, having to climb back up all these stairs. Well, they had a railway originally, but I think they stripped it so they oh. could make different railways elsewhere. That makes all more sense. Yeah. So there's torches. They gave me a tour of the whole place off stream because they they wanted to. Um... Ah, I don't. It's not important. Do they want to recruit you. It potentially. Up. Mm. Poten potentially. No, no secrets, Red. We're we're all on the same team here. Yeah, they wanted to recruit me. Oh, good. Piracy is better than terrorism. Piracy? <laughs> <laughs> this is a low bar. This is a low bar. Piracy is better than tourism. Uh, real pirates don't steal stuff. That's Jake and the Neverland Pirates that says that. Well, maybe they're right. Maybe they're right. Maybe we should all just be like Luffy D. Monkey. Or, uh, sorry, yeah. Monkey D. Luffy. Got it backwards. You're good. Maybe we should take these lanterns too. Oh I yeah. About it. Do uh, I don't want to drop the gold. I'll drop the coal. I have one empty slot. I could carry them. Oh, I'll I found an you. empty slot. I'm good. Uh, oh wait. Oh yeah. We're all gonna consolidate them, right? Yeah. Okay. So Ozel, are you holding them? It'll be useful for lookout lanterns. Sure. There you go. Thank you. Perfect. All right. Now I have nothing. Or no empty slots left, so... Yard! enough iron to make things? That's insane. That's like the biggest flex in the server, I'm not gonna lie. Having enough iron to make a suit? Or lanterns. Or lanterns? <laughs> yes. Wasting iron on lanterns. That is a flex and a half. Yeah. Uh, where are our horses? Uh, down there. They're right. down there somewhere. There's also a skeleton. new horse friends. Yeah, I took the saddle from the skeleton horse. Hopefully ah, good idea. Um, where's mine? I think... Uh, was yours the black one? Mine was a gray one, I thought. Oh, you can have this one. Uh, it's fine, I'll just take the black one, I guess. Oh, I put the gray one over here. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I accidentally got the wrong black one. I put him in the pen. Well, is the skeleton horse better, potentially? Or no? Does it burn? It's right here. Well, the skeleton horse isn't burning right now. There we go. Yeah, we'll Skeleton just swap. Skeleton horses do fit in, or do fit the vibe more for pirates. Yeah, I think I'll go with the skeleton horse. 
Okay. Yeah, I'll be back in one moment. Just gotta go grab it. All right. Last time I came here, there was armor in this chest. All right, Mr. Bones. It's adventure. Oh, he is so slow. He is so slow. Oh, there's an axe in here. Well, he has no muscles. You're right. You're right. He's got no muscle mass. It's impressive he's even walking right now. You guys want to come in and look at what's in here? There's is there. Oh, there's another shulker box. Oh what? There's a shulker box. I'm gonna use it. Who lived here? Nothing. Piercing, respiration three, unbreaking three, two diamond blocks. What? I can take diamond blocks. Bandit's axe. Well, I'm going to take that. That'll be helpful for the fort while we're trying to get wood. Whoa. What a weird place. I got bone meal. I'm going to keep my seeds so that we can use them for uh, planting crops. Oh, how bizarre. Oh, and they have iron. They have raw iron. Ooh. Sweet. Who could have lived here? Maybe it was the... Hey, whoa. Yo, look at this. They got pig step and Ooh. so many shulker boxes. This one has Hyrule tour guides. They they forgot a chest before they left. A slime block? Yo. What? Wait, we can all have a shulker box or, or more. <laughs> yeah, yeah, grab grab this. This is the good stuff. Uh, I'm going to put I'm going to put uh some of these uh, these shulker uh well, I'll, I'll put the goods in here. Holy moly. This is insane. This is the this is the steal of the century. Yeah, this is crazy. They won't know. They won't care. I'm sure they'll be fine with this. They're but, the ones who left it here, right? Yeah, they they don't. It's trash at this point. They don't care about it. It's technically abandoned. Yeah, yeah. It's it's in the trash. Nobody lives here. We are we are liberating these items and giving them a new life. The rescue items, it's like the horse. Yeah, rescue items. Where's my trash can? Oh gosh, I don't have a trash can. Um, yeah. Trying to make tea. What the heck is Hyrule Tour Guide? Oh, that's a book that's in the uh, Shrine of Resurrection. Or it was supposed to be. Uh. Yeah. Oh, wow. you can click to teleport to places. That can't work, right? Yeah, that doesn't work anymore. But that that's if you're in creative and you wanted to play on the server. Uh. That's what it's designed for. How fascinating! F bloody freaking fascinating. We I can't believe they forgot this stuff. Holy moly. Oh, these spruce saplings are insane for wood? For lookout landing? Yeah, I, th that was mentioned a bit earlier too. By um, We actually got some spruce saplings from Bunyan Town. The mayor, Sly, gave it to us. Holy moly. Wow. That's what cool. What an incredible steal. I'm so glad that we stopped here. Yeah. Well, th this is a great shortcut. We should take shortcuts more often. Horse, get yeah. back here. We did not give you permission to leave. You belong to us. How many boxes did you guys take? Uh, oh, one, two, okay. three, four, five, six. You can take the rest. Grazzy's horse was trying to escape, but I am making an example of it by, by making it do laps in the pool. <laughs> ha! Take that, fool! It's what you get for trying to escape. I'm also going to check out this place. Are we ready to dip? Or are we just one more? I... One moment. I'm kind of curious if... I wonder if anyone will less anything else. Huh. Yeah. I kind of wondered if Grazzy would put a secret in this house. Because he has a diary that he hides on all the parts of the map that he's been to. And he's built. Hmm. Oh well. Oh well. Whatever. It's not important. It's not the biggest deal in the world. Yeah. Uh, oh, and there's more lanterns. Yeah. Who's... We'll we'll ignore them. It's fine. We have enough stuff. Yeah. Has anybody seen Skellion? No. Nope. Growlion's right here. There's Growlion. Where's Skellion? Where could it possibly be? Yo. Take that. Where did that. my horse go? Oh, he's ah. right here. The skeletons right here. Oh, you found it. Yeah, he's on me. Ha ha ha! There we go. And we have oh, all creeper, of our. Creeper. Oh, I'll kill it. We have our no, it lagged. No. Did I hit it? Oh no! I hit your horse. I'm sorry. No. He's dead. It's no. It's okay. I have wheat. Oh, 
Did it fix it? Uh, momentarily, yeah. It should be good emotional now. Emotional damage. Yeah, the emotional, the emotional damage is what's really gonna kill it. Oh man, the stress. And you're now you're making it walk over fire, you monster. <laughs> yeah. Are we the baddies? Oh, no. It's no. Like, you know the type of um, therapy, exposure therapy or whatever. <laughs> that's what. That's what I'm doing to it. Help it get better. I think we're the bad guys. No. Come on. I mean, I mean, we're going. Better. I'm riding a skeleton horse. Well, that's just because it looks cool. Exactly. I mean, listen to our horn. Like one moment. It does sound kind of ominous. I think we're the bad guys. It's okay because we have pig step, right? Yeah, we have pig step. We can be the bad guys. All we can right. get with yeah, that. Yeah, it's all uh, good. Right at, wait. I think the better route is going this way. And then go no, I'm pretty sure that this is it. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah, that end of the village. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's at the bottom of the village, but it's this direction. Good catch. Who knows if we're really good or bad? Good point, Wee Monkey too. Yeah, so what? Skeleton horse is a little slow. Yeah. What happened on this server that would that would, like, if they, we're gonna do some lore theorizing? What would happen on the server that would mean all the all the people disappeared and we're the only ones left? Um, an internet outage. <laughs> <laughs> the internet in Hyrule is gone. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> Disappears. What the goddesses are like, you know, it'd be pretty funny if we only populated the world with seven people and just Maybe had them. Maybe everyone just fights each other. What if the gloom kills them all off? You know what I'm saying? The malice. Or they migrate. Heads. But true. Maybe they all went to Breath of the Wild 3. <laughs> Breath of the Wild 3. I'm, I'm really banking on there being a sequel set in the same universe but in a different part of the world oh yeah definitely they're not gonna i don't think they're gonna change link or zelda no just it, the world because they left so many untied ends at the end of the story especially with master koga it's implied that he's still alive the robot literally says he's fine he'll still cause trouble but he's not here yeah. for now and then still, uh, yeah then there's the other one i'm sure you guys know the bird our bird boy oh Cass. yeah Cass. where is he he died. Oh. Made in his chicken wings. Oh my goodness! I can't believe you! Chicken wings are good. I don't blame you. Yeah. What? You guys are ridiculous. No, he's not chicken wings. He's fine. Oh, okay, okay. Cass is fine. My boy can't be chicken wings. I need to hear more of his accordion solos. Sure. Maybe. We're thinking about this all wrong. Somebody in my chat has a good theory. R C H E Wellet. They say maybe we are the beginning of humanity in Hyrule. That's interesting. Like us or like all of us. We're the beginning. Wow. That's impressive. I, I like that theory. That's a good one. Yeah. We're probably the beginning of humanity in this world. Exactly. They wish they could be us. Oh wow, this is this horse is really good with water. I was gonna say your horse is so fast under water. What? Skeleton horses seem to be better in water, huh? Hey, I'll take that. That's really water good on the server. Water goes through them. Yeah, That's water just goes through. Wait, then if you build a path from uh, Eventide Island to like the mainland, you could take Whoa. your skeleton horse and it'll be fast. Wait, that's actually smart. I don't know if it'll be. Oh yeah. On a boat, but. Like just one block deep. One block underwater. deep water. Huh. Yeah. Good idea. I like that. But yeah, it's it's really close now. We're we're almost there practically. It's just just a hop, skip, and a jump away, and we're gonna finally be at the uh, at the spot where Lookout Landing's supposed to be. Now hopefully there's nobody there already claiming it, squatting on my land. How long did it take us for for us to get to this point? I started at 3:30. It's it's an hour and 20 minutes now. Go directly west. Follow me, follow me. Oh, directly west? Yes. Good eye. Good eye, Mr. Gibbs. We have our heading. 
speaking of Mr. Gibbs, I had to teach a class uh, on Thursday, an English class on Thursday, and that was a blast. You two weren't, you two, you two didn't get to hear this story, but I got to teach two of my favorite stories in English class. Because the, the English teacher, she knows me. She's like, oh, you love these stories. We're teaching The Great Gatsby and Animal Farm in class. Oh, I'm reading The Great Gatsby. Yeah. And I'm she said, the last chapter of it. Oh, I was on the party chapter. And she said, hey, Ooh. since you love it, here's my copy of the book. It has all my notes in it. I need you to read this chapter and then uh, guide the discussion in class the next day. They're all, they're all pretty mature students. It'll be easy. And man, I loved it. I ended up skimming the whole book instead of just the chapter she told me. Because it's The Great Gatsby. Who doesn't love that? I listen to 20s music in my free time. And then for Animal Farm, I took a class in college on the history of the Soviet Union. I am way overqualified for that. So I, I ended up teaching both. Uh, and I, I, I think it went well. I told them the history of Stalin and how he was a thugster. A handsome thugster in his younger, year, younger years. Mm -hmm. Fun fact. Uh, so this is it. This is the start. It seems smaller than Look How Landing. The moat does, at least. Well, that's, uh, that's true. <laughs> uh, so, Lookout Landing in Breath of the Wild is smaller because it's just the ceremonial yeah, pedestal it's just, that's supposed yeah. to be here. And Grazzy hasn't built it yet because he hasn't got to this part of the server yet. Yeah. Um, what they did in Tears of the Kingdom is they expanded it, so it actually goes out to more like here. Like, everything's yeah. pushed away. All the water's pushed away. So should the wall start, like, here? Um... Yeah, I yeah. guess so. I guess it should start there, and we should use the wood for that. I'll get the wood out. So what are we doing? We're going to have to build Lookout Landing right now. But we also need some dirt and uh, so we could fill in the area around us. And we'll need to dig down to make the underground cellar. Oh, oh the Mifa. Mifa's coming over here. Get look. Oh, look at that! Fish person! How's it going, Mifa? Hello. I hear you. You, I hear you loud and clear. Welcome to Lookout land. Landing. This is this is our land now. Nice. You can touch the water. That's international waters. But this is our land. It's the country of Lookout Landing, controlled by pirates. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. Are you intimidated? Not really. Guys, she's not intimidated. What are we doing wrong? Wait, 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 I have it. I have I it just yeah, 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 I'm not yeah. intimidated because I'm not here to attack you. Interesting. Yes, of course. You're not here to attack us. Yes, you're here to bring you're us here tribute. To show her this. <laughs> There's not much to attack right now, I'm not going to lie. Well, sure there is. We we have lots of stuff. Like, uh, we have Mr. Bones. We have my Skellion. Um, there's, there's a lantern over here. You should be so terrified out of your boots right now. I'm surprised you even are wearing boots. Well, they have Death Strider on them. This isn't working. Okay, why did you come over here? Fish person, reveal your secrets! I can swim faster than you? No, 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 no. I meant, like, why did you, why did you come over here? I was curious. Oh, that's a good answer. That's a good answer. Uh, well, we're we're building it. We're building Lookout Landing, and we're gonna we're gonna control all of Central Hyrule. And since since your people have been so kind to us, uh, we would like to offer an alliance between the people of Lookout Landing, the pirates of Lookout Landing, and uh, the fish people of sure. the Zora's Domain. It's a natural sure. alliance, you know, the water people with the pirates. What could go wrong? We even got a cool flag. True. Yeah, yeah. This is the biggest selling point. So, so what do you say? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Boom. We got it, boys. Let's go. Party. Oh, don't, 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 don't do that. Uh, eat, eat some bread, guys. Bread on me. Right. We will form a pact through our bread consumption. Mm -hmm. that was a plan. Just pretend I'm eating it. My hunger bar is full. I'll take that. Oh, wait a minute, Howie said something in the chat. He said, oh, so it's a mod. Like, I was like, is there a Dynamap or something I don't know about? Huh. Dynamap, Dynamap. Oh, oh, Howie was asking about what kind of world map we're using. Yeah, yeah, Howie, we're using a mod. The Dynamap mod, or something like that. It's it's good. All, all the people on the server are using it. Except you, apparently. Good stuff. 
Um, how's the how's the hole looking? Uh, small. Keep up the good work. I'm working on it though. I'm gonna go get some dirt. Come, Skellion. Oh yeah, we're digging the greatest hole of all time. Nobody builds holes greater than me. And Solus, who is doing it in my stead. Okay. Hey, you. Stop. There we go. Whew, monsters. Can't live with them. Uh, would like to live without them. <laughs> oh my you goodness. Drop my bread. That's outrageous. Who did that? I'm sorry. It's all right. Mr. Razzle, that is 12 Cat 09s for you. I'm kidding. That would be too violent. <laughs> we can't show that on stream. <laughs> oh, actually, I need to heal my horse. Uh, oh, wait. I can't heal my horse. It doesn't take food. How do I heal my horse? Do I feed it bones? How do, how do I heal Skellion? Anybody know? I don't know. I don't know. Who knows? We don't, obviously. Where's this water coming from? Well, that's not good. Oh. Okay, yeah, we need defenses up immediately. Where's my axe? I dropped it! No! Has anybody picked up a diamond axe with decent enchantments on it? Oh, it's over here. Ah, ha, ha, thank you. Just, just, th yes, thank you. Thank I'm gonna you. go light the it. area, the surrounding area. All the bread, zombie. Oh, don't worry about it. I, I, I am built to withstand damage. Okay. I have a thick skin. Yeah, just gotta, just gonna have to expand this here. Yeah. Here we go. This is it. This is the beginning of a great empire. That's what I'm saying. Oh my gosh, Solus. You know, now that we're here, we could talk about the finals. And since it's my live stream, everybody has to put up with it. Where are you? Ooh. Oh, you're underground. I'm, here, yeah, I'll join you. The finals, the video game. Have you played it yet? Me? This season, you. this season of it, yeah. No, I have not. It looks so good. The 5v5 yeah. mode is blowing me away. Mm -hmm. For the people in chat, the finals is a uh, first person shooter set on a game show, and recently the game show got hacked in lore. And they added a bunch of cool items related to it. Yep, it's a cool game, I like it. Yeah, it's got really nice movement options. Playing as light is always fun. Always fun. Uh, we don't have wood. We're we stuck down here. Wood. Yep. Azul! We'll starve down here. Azul! Where is he? Okay, I guess we'll just mine until he comes over here. Then we'll, we'll yell at him to throw down some ladders. Mm -hmm. Got some ladders? Oh, yes, Ozzel, throw down ladders. Where are you? There he is. Ha 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 ha. Yes! I don't know how big this area is supposed to Good be. Good man. Uh, Bigger than this? We'll, we'll, we'll build it up four blocks high. How about that? Maybe we should dig one more down. Here you go. Oh, yeah, good idea. We'll, we'll build four blocks high right here and then one down. We'll do both. So it's a pretty big area. I threw some ladders down. Thank you. This is a lot of ladders. My Lanta. We needed like two rows, though. I wasn't sure how many you guys needed. But it was safe and sorry. Respect it. Okay, so then we have the hole right here. Yeah, yeah, this is it. This is it. We're going to build the little pedestal that everything's built around. And people will fear us, because that's ultimately what we need in life. Exactly. Machiavelli explained it best. Tis better to be feared than loved. Exactly. Have you yeah, guys ever read The Prince? Eh? Nope. Did somebody drop their shield? Ah, crud muffins. It's the white one, isn't it? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Found it in the middle of the field. <sighs> yeah, it seems like... Uh... Urbosa's Fury has a habit of doing that. Did as long I as you're not holding something? anything in either of your hands, you're fine. Uh, I made it. Oh, look, Sidon's Hello. here. Oh, Sidon's hey. here? Hey! Hello. Welcome, Sidon. How's it going? Good, good. Hey, Brett, I got a question. What's this? Yeah, what is this? Where did you get this? 
Get, okay, so um, okay, so I've we found that at a tunnel in the middle of nowhere. Could you place her right? in Cockery? Right in there. I was gonna. The only that. one that I know of that I've seen around is the one in the in Cockerico in in Horatum's base. No, we saw those in their other base, but you guys weren't there, would you? Okay. The only ones that I know of were in Great Plateau and they're basing. Okay, you know what? You know what? Okay. Okay, I'll come clean. I'll come clean. We just came back from Kakariko. And we saw that yeah, the entrance I, was open. I had a feeling. And it looked like a pirate flag. So we were like, yep, that's ours. Yeah. I had a feeling because we took down all their banners that are like that in their Great Plateau base. Unless you know where their new base is. But I wish I knew where their pattern was. Me. I wish I knew where they were keeping their banner pattern. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That'd be awesome. Yeah, I, want, um, I need to tell you, Roger. Jokes might That's... have it because... Or... Wait, Horlton might have it because he's the one that stole the Wither Skull from Gerudo Town in the first place. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Let's... Let, let's... Let me just let me just say something. That banner pattern, I assume you know, is affiliated with Horlton and his team. I thought it was their Gricken pattern that was more, um associated with their team because that was like a whole shtick that for those banner patterns were already in kakariko before they got there that that ah. area that little cave thing that you saw i mean besides the stairway leading down to the other thing that was all there before ah so i remember because i've seen that location before this server even in, existed so we can't use the pattern uh the griffin pattern no, the, the the Jolly Roger pattern. Probably I mean, not. I don't. It would be it, people could probably confuse you for being on Horlton's side if you use that. I'll say that. What if we just culturally appropriated? I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Uh. I mean, if you wanna if you wanna risk being associated with Horlton, then or I mean, you know, people assuming you're associated with Horlton, then by all means. No, no, no. We'll culturally appropriate it so that nobody remembers them. It's genius. We will erase well, that their would image. Mean first we have to take. Wouldn't that mean first we'd have to like, like get rid of them first? Because. No. Then there wouldn't be anything to associate it with. No, you you could always you could just always you could culturally appropriate whenever what you want. Really, it's yeah, it's okay. It's 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 well, uh, Europeans it, did it all the time that, for then, a few years. It was pretty cool back yeah. then. Yeah, so you know it's not not that not that hard. Not if you want to if you want to do that, I guess that's by all means. I'm just saying. <sighs> yeah, you're weird. You're right. We probably yeah, got to find a different flag. As much yeah. as I hate to say this, but I am going to have to log off now, but I should be on again in a few hours. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. I won't All be right. on then. I'm probably going to be off within the next hour, but thank you for letting us know. It was nice seeing you, yeah. Princess of, of course, Azora. It was nice seeing you too. I'm glad I was able to make it for a little bit of the time. Of course. Of course. Very well. Oh, yeah. Right, I'll talk uh, to you guys later. Bones. Bye, Misa. You needed sand, right? Mm -hmm. Hold on, real quick. Uh, skill. Placed on the yeah. address. Is it? There you go. Thank you, I appreciate it. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Good luck with landing. Thank you. All right. Okay. Um, speaking of Horltum and his allies, they did say they were planning on doing their thing. They're going through with their clan soon right sometimes you this mean weekend, the, they said you mean the giga clan uh, yeah apparently they're um not going through I with don't it think quite... we mean that yeah. but... Hor I... Tom is the giga clan at this point isn't he i kind of had a feeling because uh bread i'm just gonna i'm just gonna i'm just gonna say it we've kind of been destroying any hope of their plans to blow up Gerudo town any plans lately their plans to blow up Gerudo Town, we may or may not have completely raided their second base. Their second one already? And How? Well, the one that they made after moving out of Kakariko Village. We found their oh second gosh. base underneath Great Plateau. And uh, I kind of have all of their TNT and gunpowder and that sand shulker box that I just gave to Umbrains was theirs. 
So yeah, it doesn't surprise me that they're holding off on that for now. Not to mention, I have their go I have goat's goat horn that I took from them as well. <laughs> but well, dang. So we've been pretty on it lately. We've been pretty we've been pretty well on the case. So if they're the Yiga clan, what what do you call yourselves? Your alliance. Well, I'm a part of the champions team. That includes me, Umbrains, Goat, uh, Ezio, and um, Toby. Okay. We're all we're all the champions. Skill is uh, associated with us. He's 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 a sage. Yeah. That's Sidon right there. <laughs> I Plus, see. You know, we got we got like allies, like I mean, alliances. You know, people that people that are helping us. Not necessarily a part of our team but people that are people that are helping the cause yeah sympathetic to the cause yeah i get like that stopping uh, stopping the literal obliteration of gerudo town the wiping out of an entire very important town in the server in this in hyrule yeah for its history yeah <laughs> yeah there's a lot of people that don't want that to happen yeah, probably a good thing that we didn't end up doing that. Yeah. Well, if they're not gonna do that today, then I guess we'll. I guess we're fine for now. For now. I also heard from Sly that you are you decided to not associate with them any longer because they threatened you with TNT. Um. Yeah. Okay, uh, they threatened a then... few people with TNT. Yeah. Kind of well, messy. Well, then I guess... Messy yeah, politics. If the case, then... Yeah, if that's the case, then you're fine, then. Okay. Honestly, it's good that you've done that, because uh, if not, you probably would have had the same fate they they will. <laughs> yeah, and you know, I mean, we might be pirates, but we're more like, um, you know, like, miscreant pirates. You know, good kind. That's... Yeah, that's not a problem. Yeah, just don't be causing, just don't be causing like too much trouble. You know, like don't blow up an entire town. That would be recommended. If yeah, I'll I'll <laughs> avoid that. I'll, I'll avoid that in the future. Yeah. Or else, or else I might have to pay a little visit. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just don't, just don't visit Hateno. It might look a little worse for wear. Um, just don't, vi don't look. Uh, that that was not probably me i if it was if it was me i wouldn't do it and i i probably did not do it i will keep that in mind yes because that does not sound like something that i would do oh the gralian i see you got that as well yeah That's we found it in there it's a rescue animals. animal we're uh we're taking it in yeah Foster That's parents. Like today, that's Grazi's old horse. I guess they, yeah, Hortum, Hortum, Hortum stole it from Grazi at some point. And was hiding it in their Kakariko base. Yeah. Freaking crazy. The lore on this server. Hmm. Okay, um, one, two. Where is Apona? There's an Apona? Apona, what are you doing all the way over here? <laughs> oh, of course, you have an Apona. Yeah, because you have the Link skin. I mean, I do too, but my Link skin is a little bit Anyways, different. I was just stopping by to see what was going on. I heard there was something going on at, uh, you know, Central Hyrule. So yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. Stop by. Good stuff. You guys are building Lookout Landing, it seems. Yep, yep. We're claiming all of Central Hyrule for ourselves, because last time it didn't go very well. But now we now instead of trying to to build in the cesspool known as Hyrule Castle Ruins, where we're we're doing it from fresh. Right here with a, a nice little moat around us. Uh -huh. it's, a, it's a nice manageable size. Someone just logged on. Some an in, a little interesting fellow. Hey, Skill. Yeah. Did you uh, see that chat message there? Perhaps. Oh, uh, it did. Oh, and it just started raining. Oh, look at that. That's not dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> it definitely. Doesn't give skill in it all. Not, not, no, 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 no it's possible totally, advantage. It doesn't yeah. oh. allow he definitely me to doesn't fly have or anything. Three. No, surely of course. not. I'm to travel with anybody else on this server right now. Yeah, this Speaking is. Speaking of flying, do you even really need Magnesis? <laughs> I really don't, but 
Why let anybody else have it? Take it for your own. Give nothing back. Exactly. I mean, it was mine, but I kind of, I kind of gave it to him because he helped save my gear. It's like, why not? Oh, this is cool. I like this little section. Solus, is this what you're working on? You die. Yeah, it didn't show a yeah. chat death message, right. so I, I like guess it. nobody really noticed. I need to make the little nose statue. Black. Black. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That could have been a lot so worse. Close. How do I help? Uh, just help with the walls, I guess. Anyways, um, yeah, that's Actually, interesting. Yields. Do we? Shall we head on out of here, or do you, do we want to just wait here and see if anything happens? Get the crafting table. Uh, we can maybe go back to Zor's domain. Yeah, we won't cause any trouble. Good pirates don't yeah, don't, don't cause think trouble. You guys are going to be causing any trouble. There, yeah, we there trust is somebody you. online right now that uh, may or may not be uh, may not may or may not have a target on their head right now. Ooh, a bounty hunting. Yeah, we definitely didn't declare war with anybody or anything. Yeah, I wouldn't declare war on anybody either. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. No, yeah, that we never did that. We never did that. No bases were raided for uh, literally everything they had. No people are being hunted down currently. Nothing like that. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. We're totally not going to ask you if you want to join us try to kill someone right now. No, that of course be, not. I mean, I mean, even if that were a possibility, like, even if that were something we would maybe do, I mean, think about it. It would be kind of interesting content-wise, right? Hunting hunting down the old... Hunting down a player, perhaps? A like that, player? That would be a player, yes. A player uh, in some particular. some shy guy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to talk with my um, managers real quick. Okay. Sure. Okay, chat, I'm gonna make a poll. I'm gonna make a poll. Start a poll. We're starting a poll right now. Yeah, 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 you know how it is. It is, it is game show time. I don't have game show music. Uh, what could I do for game show music? I don't really have any. We'll do this. Yeah. This is good. Give the numbers in. Get the numbers in. Let's see. Well, how is it gonna be? In the meantime, I'm gonna check on our live stream status. We have 49 people in chat, seven people commenting per minute. That's a pretty decent pace. We have had 800 views thus far, a little bit smaller than normal. That's totally fine. I've been live streaming a lot. And average viewer duration of, ele of seven minutes and 11 seconds. That's good stuff. Chat, keep him here. <laughs> Somebody is uh, a little bit biased. I'll wait until the song is halfway done. I'm, ke I'm keeping an eye on it. Yeah, it'll take a second. In the meantime, I'm going to keep working on the bass. And we could just talk for a minute. Uh, Natu's watching the whole stream. Natu, thank you. Yeah. In fact, I think before we go, I'm going to need to practice my Duolingo Spanish with you guys. Because I have not done that yet. I need to do it every day, and I have not done it today. It's important to do it. You don't want to fall behind on Duolingo Spanish, because if you do, bad things happen. Worse than anything on the server we've seen thus far. Let's just say I've had some uh, threats towards my family when I've missed the days. Not good stuff. Not good stuff. Don't, don't skip your Duolingo. Once you start, you're committed. Yeah, this is good. Oh, I ran out. Oopsies. Okay, I'm gonna be ending it in three, two, one. Poll is ended. There we go. And it looks like we're gonna be hunting the Yiga. All right, I've talked with my managers. We're in. Uh huh. Okay. Right. We're in. Although well, I need to get a fast horse. I need to put some of my stuff away. Um. I'll just I'll just put it in the basement. 
Yeah, we'll put it yeah, in the basement, you, you yeah. You got that? Nice. <laughs> Ooh, All right, strikes. just let me know when you're ready to take off, and we'll be out of here. All right. And some of us might take off, literally. <laughs> yes, literally <laughs> yeah. taking off. Yeah, you, you really did just take off there, buddy. That was... <laughs> terrible that was plan, amazing. I know. Um... Yeah, I guess we're just, we're just kind of... Uh, don't step too close to the skeleton horses, by the way. Oh, don't worry, we won't. That it's, I, I just recently learned that it's not a random chance. <laughs> if you get too close, they will they will get struck by lightning. Good to know. <laughs> I thought it was the non-tamed ones. Well, yeah, the non-tamed ones, obviously. If they're tamed, they're fine. We don't need that. Don't need that. Do need that. Um, we need some food. Hmm. We'll just we'll just take this. That'll be my food for today. Food for thought. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah, and we'll pack we'll pack light. Alright. Hey Brad, are you into golden carrots by any chance if you need food? Yeah, I, I could eat those, sure. They're pretty good. Ah, thank you. Yeah. I go. definitely don't have like three stacks of food in my inventory. Like, uh, stuff. <laughs> yeah. Also, how do okay. you how do how do you revive a, a skeletal horse? It gets health. Uh, carrots, apples, golden apples. But golden wheat carrots. doesn't work on a, a skeletal horse. Oh, skeletal. I mean, I think horses just re re naturally regenerate over time. It's just slow. Okay. Okay. Hey, Solus, yeah. do you still have those arrows? Yeah. Could I have some of those? Let me find the chest. Yes. I need to find the right. Yeah, they're in there. Sweet. Thank you. And mm -hmm. honestly, Brad, if I'm being honest, helping us with this, I mean, you gain the trust of the of the champions. You got a pretty strong team on your side. If you ever need them. Yeah. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. Whew. I'm gonna set my spawn here. At dawn, we we strike. Oh look at that! It's oh, dawn. It's not <laughs> raining anymore. <laughs> All right, you ready? Okay, sure. Oops, I didn't need it. Oh, you picked up my lead. Oh, That's fine. My bad. You take it. I don't need it. How do you even get a lead yeah. on this server? Uh, you can craft them. Um, the, uh, you know where the, uh, Forgotten Temple is? That yeah. cat, that giant, like... The yeah, giant dungeon. That entire thing is, a, is like, a bunch of slime chunks. Ha, slime funny. spawn down there. I wonder if that was intentional. Yeah, I don't know. It is kind of funny. Okay, so where slime do we go? spawn down there all the time. We go to um, Akala Citadel. Yeah, oh. Akala. That's where, that's where their okay. current, uh, base is located. And I definitely don't think they'd have enough time to move if they, since they kind of know we know about their base location now already, but like, I don't think they could have moved in time. But yeah, Jokes is likely there. Uh, that's what we're going to check first. Yes. Before we kill him, we have to talk with him and get some intel, obviously. That wouldn't be a... Oh, where's the where's the rest yep, of my boys? Good. I guess they're yeah. behind working I think on they're the just landing. staying behind. All right. Yeah, they can they can watch lookout landing while you're gone. Yes. Would uh, you be living at Eventide though? Oh yeah. Well, you, you don't have a summer home. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, fair enough. Rich pirate, I see. Oh yeah, yeah. And you know, I could I could use more room to build farming. Uh, farming equipment at Central Hyrule is good. It's nice and close to everyone else on the server, so I can go to Eventide in the summer, and I can go to the uh, look uh, this lookout landing area during the winter. Or wait, I got it backwards. Either way, yeah, it'll be good. Alright, we're getting. Well, then region. We just gotta go past that. Honestly, 
There's just isn't there just a path that goes directly through Akala from um, the wetlands? I have not been there yet. To the entrance of Zora's domain. I've not been there. I think uh, we just have to traverse the terrain. Yeah, it'll be quicker this I mean, way. We can cross the rivers, but yeah, you know, it is it is kind of a we'd have to go like down like south a quite a ways. So honestly, it'd probably just be faster to keep going the way we're going at this rate. Yeah. So what is our group name now? Still champions? Uh, I'm still yeah I'm still a part of the champions. We're just kind of we can be allies. Yeah, we're like distant allies, temporary allies. Yeah. Yeah. Temporary. I mean, if you don't give us any reason to not trust you, we'll always, we'll always, you know, be there if you need, if you need assistance. Yeah. Well, we can call we're this very, trio the Brett Champions. We're very loyal. We're very loyal to <laughs> our trusted Brett Champions, allies. sure. <laughs> I like that idea. It's a good naming scheme. Bread Champions. So, chat, how's it going? How's it going? Any plans for today? I'm curious. I'm looking at the chat right now. I have been the entire time. If anybody has any questions, or if you have anything you want to share about how your weekend's going, let me know. I love hearing about that stuff. Somebody said, okay, good. Part of the plans is being here, says Nate. <laughs> Thank you, Nate. I got homework, says Omega Dan Kong. Ooh, good luck with that. Somebody's been playing Animal Crossing, says, is I know, or is I cow? I don't really know how to say your name. I always, I always forget. He got away, says Pokefan. I don't know. Nobody's gotten away. I have no idea what you're talking about. Gonna have to start meal prepping for next week soon, says JB. Ooh, interesting. Oh, yeah. St. Patrick's Day is coming up soon. What day is that this week? I, I need to come up with a Sunday school lesson for tomorrow. I've been stalling on that. And I think that making it themed after... Making it themed after uh, St. Patrick's Day would be really cool. I've been AFK at a creeper farm on the spawn I play on. Says Sensei... Sensei... Sensei Ed? Sensei Ed. Oh. 317? Oh, so tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day. It is tomorrow. That's good. What are you using in order to make those Rivalis, Gales, and Mifas grass... Grace things happen, says Shakedwald. That is a plugin that is being designed specifically for this server by Graz, uh, by Grazzy's friend, Hauziki. Hauziki is very impressive, uh, and very impressive at making data packs. That's what they're called. I don't know how I'm a member, not gonna lie, says Kato. Kato, you are a member because somebody donated memberships to the server. You just got, just take it. Just order anything. All right, how's it look? Are we almost there? Um... Yeah, yeah, it's right at the Citadel ruins, so it's pretty close. The base is underneath the tower. It's under a trapdoor. Yeah. How do you know where it is? I found Gil's it. Gil's been there. He found it. Yeah. There's this flying... Yeah, yeah let's just say we get around on the it. server. There isn't really many places you can hide. <laughs> oh, dear. If you were trying to hide from us. Well, that's not intimidating I mean, at all. <laughs> yeah, that's not more intimidating than I thought, but like, let's, to be honest, that's kind of yeah. We we know that's, we know this. That's we know the point. I rule pretty well. Yeah, that's kind of the point too. Uh, remind yeah. me, which of you were builders? Uh, skill, you weren't a builder. Uh, I, me, and Umbrains and Goat. I think Toby's also a builder. So basically, yeah, technically, yeah, I'm not all a the builder, champions but... are builders. All the champions are builders. Skill okay. is a sage, but he he does have access to the server. He's just he's not. Yeah. Like, ah, interesting. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so you do know the map pretty well, then, having worked yes. on it. Yes. Yeah, I do know it very well. Oh, interesting. Why is... How is Akala... How is there any progress in Akala? I thought that on the survival world, this was built before that. Um, well, we still... Uh, uh, okay, this is breaking lore, breaking canon. Yes, breaking this canon. Is, uh, uh, we still are working on the map in, you know, in the background. This is just, you know, obviously this is hosted on a separate server using like a copy of the world that was made like uh i think the 27th of february yeah so but yeah uh part right of a call was done a call is a call is like almost done i'll say that much a call is like almost done okay okay at the moment. That's, that's good to know yeah we don't have much left to, to work on in a call than the actual build server so very cool yeah 
So, but yeah, but the uh, the creative server has more progress done on Akala than this does. Uh, yes. Whoa. Okay, so this is the first time it's probably been live streamed. Or no, 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 no. Grazi's been live streaming himself building this stuff, right? Uh, he live streamed yeah. Terrytown, yeah. Terrytown, but Akala, this might be the first time. Wow. This is yeah. This might be the first time this has a this has been. Besides, like, maybe sneak peeks or screenshots that might have been sent out. Holy moly. Or something moly. like that to, like, his serve Discord server. But, yeah, no, this is... For a lot of people, I assume this is their first time seeing Akala Citadel. Okay, well, let's go in. Yeah. The pathway... And there, Voxel, you actually there. worked on this, didn't you? Yes, you made I the, did. The trees I helped stuff. build a lot of... Um, Ombrains came up with the tr design for the trees. I just helped kind of copy that over to make different like tree templates. Uh, I did help on the entrance and a lot of and the stairs and a lot of just the little like a lot of the big like parts of this build I helped with. Yeah, I, I helped make these. Yeah, the stairs. A lot Absolutely of it was bonkers. copy and paste though. We kind of we well obviously, to, but that's that's yeah. how you you do it. You copy and paste it for a while. It just yeah makes it. A lot faster. If there's no point in building it all over again, why not just copy and paste? That's how the walls of the Great Plateau were made too, right? Copy and pasting. I believe so. And then these adjusting. Are technically, it. yeah, I think these are technically like very similar to the Great Plateau walls. We still had to rebuild it anyways because wow. we couldn't just copy. At least for the entrance, the entrance was like straight up Great Plateau, but you know we couldn't copy it over because the angle was weird. Yeah, my word, it's crazy to see how the building skills on the server have evolved over time. Yeah. I actually missed the build session that was for this part specifically, unfortunately, but everything else I was there for. Uh, at least for a Call of Citadel. Careful not to step on any of the malice. Yeah, it's, Ooh, it's dangerous. The base is down this shop Ooh, door that was close. over here. Yeah, I'm just gonna tie my horse to the tower real quick. Alright. Tie up your horses, just park them wherever. And we can explore the base. I'm gonna put mine inside this little hidey hole. Uh, where'd it go? Where'd my horse go? Um, Found it. Alrighty. Farewell, Skellion. Alright. Alright, let's find yeah, it. Yeah, their base is in here. Over here. Actually, I haven't follow seen me, their follow base. Me, here. Follow me, follow me, follow me. Oh, down here. Down this trapdoor. Yeah, oh. they didn't really hide it well. Should so I... Obviously, you can tell it's Whoa. stairs because of this. But what about these buttons? Oh, yeah, uh, that's... The buttons, I mean, kind of breaking the cannon again, but, like, in the map, if you have Zero's world map, uh, this is so that you don't see underground. Oh. When you're near it. Because it, this counts as a full that's, block, so it doesn't smart. show that's up on actually, the map. That's yeah. actually smart, yeah. That's really smart. Gunpowder, feathers... Got a bunch of random stuff in here. Oh, well, Voxel, I found why they need the soul right sand. There. Hmm. Wheat. Yeah. I'll just take they, the wheat. I don't making, need anything else. Look. That's a stasis chamber right there. They have malice blocks. Look. Down here. Stasis chamber. Oh. Huh. Well, there isn't any pearls in there. Uh, yeah, I figured that's... something down here. That's crazy. That's... The amount of time it takes to put all these buttons here. We'll go down there later. We'll, we'll check down there in a minute. The Yiga Let's clan the has a lot of... Is. Oh my gosh! Uh, there isn't really anything over here. This is just kind of like the inside nope. of the citadel, looks like. Maybe when the actual server goes base. out, we should... Uh, <laughs> we should ban using the unfair map uh, map mod. Yeah, it's probably... I. Yeah. This is a yeah. little bit insane. <laughs> yeah. That's probably probably for the best that we would do that. <laughs> Imagine just hooking one of these up to a TNT. Just oh, one. <laughs> yeah, that's all it would it's take. It's just randomly pressing buttons until something blows up. Oy vey. All right, shall we go down the, the stairway of death? <sighs> yeah, sure. I guess. We go down in, what, in, what in, can in, in the basement. I think this just... Hmm. This might just be... I don't know. We'll see. Well, at least I'm not walking down there first. I will survive. Oh, 60 people in the chat right now. Welcome, everybody. We're raiding the Yiga clan right now. 
Uh, or at least I'm investigating. I haven't really done any raiding. Although I took two pieces of wheat from them. And that's really what matters at oh. the end of the day. You know, they do like building their pathways. In their last base, they had a pathway that led all the way down to the underneath the bridge to Gerudo, where the where the Hinox is. Yeah. It's like they they like having quick access to that, probably because they want to blow up Gerudo Town. If I were to assume. Yeah. How do you just casually find stuff like this? I you have to ask Gil. He's the one that found it. How? Um, funny story. I was just roaming around the map with a trident. I was flying around, and okay. I saw Ultram's name tag around Tarrytown, and he went up to a call of Citadel. So I just followed him, and Jobs was here too. I believe Jobs was in here, and then Ultram went back to Tarrytown, mined a couple spruce blocks. I don't know why. If there's uh, spruce logs, but yeah. He mined a couple of those, and then he went all the way to Faron, so I followed him there and lost track of him. But then I just came back here and I wanted to see what they were doing here, and I found this base. Yeah. Huh. Fascinating. Well, yeah, good job cool. with that. I ended up being yeah, easier than I we, thought it would be. Like I said, we get around. <laughs> <laughs> We're pretty, small map, I small found world. It, it, <laughs> Literally yeah. a small map. Yes, it's a small world. It is It is pretty small. I mean, it's still yeah. several thousand blocks big. Well, 4,000 by 4,000 about? I think... Let's see. 7,000 to... It looks like 4,000-ish by 4,000-ish. Maybe it's 5,000. Yeah. Mm, let's see. If that ends at, like, 7,000 and that ends at, like... 1,000, so like 6,000 blocks, at least from hey, Voxel, wet and, look. and wet east to Come west. Back, look. <laughs> huh? hey. Honestly. Oh, nice. Should we, should we take down the head? <laughs> Whose head is it? That's goat. Goat. Or, yeah, or it's goat fine. It's yeah, fine. Or goat -sa. Basically, yeah, I mean, yeah. Or, that's She's Urbosa on this server, so she's right. the one that controls Gerudo Town. Ugh. They did this to themselves by living in Sheikah Town, declaring war on the Gerudo, and then going into hiding. They literally have transformed into the Yiga clan. That is true. They did live in Actually, Kakariko yeah. Village. They were That's why I keep calling them the Yiga clan. I, I think they, the name they, is going to catch on. Yeah, and Grothy also lives in Kakariko, but he's not a part of them. He's a, he, he, I think he's he's based yeah he's working against him so he's Grazi's like the Sheikah pretty much. Oh, he he lives. Grazi's wait, sorry, Impa? he 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 lives there. Grazi lives in Kakariko, Yes. Grazi is Impa confirmed. Grimpa. Yeah, Grimpa. <laughs> Grimpa. He doesn't like keep his stuff in like an open chest in the middle of one of the buildings, does he? I don't know. No, surely I've not. Seen where he, I've seen where he no. lives on Kakariko Village, or, you know, where he keeps his horses anyway. Yeah. He, like, he has a house. He, he wouldn't What's do that. going yeah. on lately, it wouldn't be very smart of him to do that, let's be honest. Yeah, he, prob he probably what has a better take? place for it. Yeah. What did you take? I didn't take anything. I would. That what does not take? sound like me. I, I would... Bad. Uh, what did to he be take? fair, he could have also assumed that it was Horltum. Okay, I found Pigstep. Pigstep. Yeah, okay, I found Pigstep. Well, that's... Yeah, I don't know. It's a collector's item. Not yeah. particularly useful, but it's a collector's item. Uh, and it's... there were a ton of shulker boxes. Mm. A ton of shulker Did you boxes. take them? Yeah. yeah. They were just, they were that hidden in the back of one of the houses. Of mm, yeah. I don't know. Well, I, well, you, well, you, we'll ask Grazzy about it sometime. To, you're going to have to talk about that with Grazzy, yeah. We'll, I don't think they're Grazzies, but we'll see. We'll see, yeah. I'm assuming they're not Grazzies because uh, they were kept in the back of the house like they were meant to be hidden, but somebody forgot to hide them before leaving. Yeah, it know. felt like a very Shika thing. Uh, sorry, a very Yiga thing to do. That is something a Yiga clan member would do. Yeah, like, oh no, we're we're being raided again. Take everything you have. Get it out of here. 
but then maybe missing something along the way. Yeah. That makes me wonder. Oh, okay. I wonder this if they I wonder fun. if they have if Portal and them have like a setup in the Yiga clan hideout. I don't know where Jopes is. Yeah, I don't no. see Jopes either. I wanna see these Unless cannons. He's these look gone cool. out more east or in like into Akala. I don't see them around here. Either that or he was making his way to lookout landing and we just didn't cross paths. Yeah, I don't know this where is he cool just designed. Uh yeah. I helped with this. Grazi had like a crazy brainwave and that's where the walls came from to use walls we were like stumped on this design for like 20 minutes or you something didn't look like it up that. or something online for, like 10 minutes no we were just we were just trying to figure out how to make these look good and then he and then he puts walls there and we were both like holy crap that is the most genius huh. building design i've ever seen I've, I've seen cannons built with walls before but you guys did it in a different way i like this yeah this is classy. We, we, dude, we were struggling. We were struggling to get these to look good. <laughs> and I like how there's all yeah, this honey I built, here, too. Yeah, I built up all this, like, structure, all the all this stuff around here, like these things with the trees on them. I, I basically set all this up. Like I Damn. said, I helped, I helped with, like, the designs for, like, the... Oh, sorry. Yeah, no, that's fine. It's just as crazy. The first for, like, tour the of Akala. Structures, yeah. This is the first yes, tour anybody's ever gotten of it. Live. We probably... We probably... Should, I don't know. Probably shouldn't have, but it's too late. Yeah. It's too late to change that. We'll get, we'll get like, Terrytown a little teeny there. sneak peek of Terrytown and the base you guys made for it. Yeah, that's... Yeah, Terrytown's already finished, so that's just... Yeah, that should be... That's that's because we're on the survival server, peek. yeah. Yeah. Oh, we gotta get that's down That's also... Here. That's also not made of uh, terracotta blocks. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ah! Very right interesting cliffside. Yeah, the pink cliffside I see over by the waterfall. I can't see it right now. That was very interesting it's too. Like a staple. Honestly, we should just kept it that way. It's very, uh, very distinct, you know. Yeah, it's nice very to have distinctness. <laughs> How do we get down from here? I could uh, I could follow the oh, water. Yeah. I should I should go get a Pona. No. Yeah, I was about to say. Ooh. Let me go get a Pona. Gail the Zelda Master, thank you for the two dollar donation. Hey bro, just stopped by during dinner to say hi. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm just barely able to make that jump. That was close. That was a very close jump. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have made that. How do I get down from here? Oh my goodness. I am rightfully stuck. This is no good. Um, I guess we'll just jump into the water. Yeah, that was that was a good call. That's a good call. I have respiration, and the horse is really good with water. Sweet. Sweet! And then we could just jump over here. Easy. Easy. Uh, where'd they go? Oh, they're way up there. Nice. Oh, and there's the, there's the stable. I wonder what they have over there. I'm going to check that out real quick. Hi from Atlanta. Atlanta. That's a crazy city. The Atlanta. My father used to go down there all the time for a track conference because he's a track and field coach. Was it Atlanta? I think it was Atlanta. Maybe it's not. But he, he hasn't gone recently. That's a long time ago. Yeah, we'll set our spawn point here so that we're close by if we die. I like to habitually set my spawn points everywhere. I think I want to see just a... Unfortunately, no. Just the capital of Georgia. Just the capital of Georgia. That's all it is? Oh, I'm sorry. Somebody said Atlantis. Atlantis? No, not Atlantis. Look at all the pretty trees. Ah! I love that. They're gorgeous. Yeah. I'm just like, just gonna sneak over here take a look at this. Ah, so much cool stuff. He hasn't done Death Mountain, though, in this version. I don't know if he has if he is doing Death Mountain right away, or if he's skipping it. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, Skill, is he doing Death Mountain next, or yeah. has he already done it? Uh, yeah, I no, I, it. I think Akala goes first, and then you're gonna do Death Mountain. So he went oh, clockwise, yeah. but he skipped Death Mountain. Yeah, Death Mountain. We're wait, we're saving Death Mountain for after Akala, but since we're almost done with Akala, we're probably. I, I I'm not gonna say. Like, I don't know when exactly, obviously. We haven't, like, 
We're not, but we are almost done with Akala, so probably soonish we'll start working on Death Mountain. Well, that's good. Yeah. Death Mountain will be hopefully easier. It's just a lot of environmental detailing yeah. you gotta add. And then I think after Death Mountain is done, he that might be what the next episode is, or that's when Gazi might start working on the next episode. Cool. So I think the plan was Akala and then Death Mountain. And then after that, we finish everything else. There might be like one or two more episodes, actually, I think. Yep. But he's not so doing the Sky doing Islands or the Depths. It. He's done. He's not doing that, right? No, that's this is just the Breath of the Wild map. Yep, just the Here's Breath of the Wild the Kingdom map. Isn't, isn't planned for development. The Sky Islands is just like a... Right, yeah, just like a single part thingy. I think it would be cool if he occasionally goes back and adds adjustments to it. So there's like a... Breath of the Wild map 1.0, then 1.1, 1.2, where, where he adds slight adjustments like, oh, we wanted to add like some dungeons that you could explore, or uh, this, the, the Hateno Village was kind of crap, so we're going to redo it. If you, I, I don't know if he yeah, thinks that, but like, maybe. yeah, I just any, know. anything. We'll see what happens. That'd be cool. Yeah. Personally, I don't know if I've told you this, I would love to add small mini dungeons around the map. And he, he said he's fine if I, I add little I treasure have, hunts. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that that does sound pretty cool. Or here's another idea. Hear me out. We we add tons of books with lore in them and stories around the map wherever there's uh, a bookshelf. True. That would also be interesting. Maybe stories yeah. of this server. That's what I'm thinking. Stories, stories of this exactly. server. Exactly. Exactly. Yes. That would be kind of cool. Wait. And then we on. could try, then we could try and write lore about why we don't exist anymore, but the next phase of the server does. And then when that's done, yeah, right so before like, we make it go public, like the we add more. Up pretty much. Yeah, that yeah, we could add the stories of that. Or like the zone. We're like pre calamity. <laughs> and we could add our own Zelda theories and try and incorporate them into the map as things that actually happened. That, that would, would be, be fun. Interesting. Yeah, that like, would wouldn't be cool. that be? Wouldn't that just be a blast? And then you, after you make all the books, you spread them out into all the bookshelves in Hyrule. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like little fragments of, of lore hidden in, yeah. in the map. That would be kind of cool, though, I'm going to be honest. It, it, it's kind of like Grazi has like this like log thing where he makes like Grazi logs that he has. Oh, I found one. Map, but that's like, yeah, I found, I think I found two of them. Well, I found one. The other one, I think somebody else found, but I have it. Yeah, this way. Yeah. Yeah, I, I love that. I have number three. Mm, I have two and five. Oh, two and five. Okay, cool. So together we could find four. True. Yeah. Because each of them gives you a hint for how to find the next one. Yeah, I think so. Polemus Mountain, actually, uh, in your your zone of the world, Zora's domain. That's where apparently oh. number three is, or number four is. Hmm. Oh. 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 That's interesting. That Should is we the leader very, of the very interesting. Clan? Should we? What do we do? do we, should we regroup at Lookout Landing and try to? Well, I need to go do my Duolingo, so have fun. Yeah. What do we do? Huh. I guess we'll just. Yeah. Should we head to Gerudo. Grazi, under in my opinion, is very focused on the uh, building aspects of the server, but. I'd like to try and help the server by making it more practical for exploring Red and with little secrets Red around the map. That's what I'd like to focus on. Going through on that yet cuz they didn't have the resources. Just going to keep on keeping on. Are they behind me? They're still behind me. That's good. Yeah, I don't really. <laughs> do 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 do. Yeah. yeah. Kind of hard to make that this is exciting. interesting that moment. I gotta, I gotta change the music. I gotta find more exciting music. The most there fitting go. one would be, would be writing day. <laughs> that would be awesome. I honestly should get that for when I'm on a long trip in the, in the server. Yeah. Yes. Genius. Yeah. But I'm, yeah. Tell me if I'm wrong. But I'm under the impression that Grazi's more interested with just finishing the creative building side of things, but not with the practical part of the server, with how it's going to function. Uh, there is some thought put into that, but right now, I mean, we have, we have, we have different people working on different things. Okay. Hazuki is doing all the data pack stuff that'll handle, like, functionality. Right, of right. Certain things. And Howie was and just talking like, in my chat about how he wants to add shrines. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and 
But we do have somebody actually... Mm, mm, actually, I don't know if I should... But yeah, Hazuki's working yeah, on Grazi, the Yeah, Grazi did adds... say that um, Holtrum was making the shrines. Oh, yeah, oh he's helping right. with the shrines? Oh, he, yes, okay. yes. Holtrum is the one building the shrines on the build map. Yo. He's building every single one from what I, from my knowledge. Yeah, I think right now he's, he's around 40 some something. Progress. Yeah, he's making good progress. 40? Already? Yeah. Yeah. Are they functional with the mechanics of the plugin? I don't know. I haven't seen any. I assume they I might don't be think eventually, so. but I don't know. That no, right there, no, that is a scary working, yeah. flower patch. Yes, it is. You die if you touch it, right? Yep. Yep. Yes, you do. And Flower Blight is actually at their Kakariko base. Oh, oh, so yeah. I've heard. Something really devious would be to put a bunch more flowers there so you can't tell which ones are safe and which ones aren't. Oh, oh. That would be funny. <laughs> then you just can't walk over there, you have to build over it. Which would then get ugly really quickly, but still funny for at least one person. Yeah. Either that, or like you have like a maze through the flowers that only you remember how to get through. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, follow like you, this you patch up specific the type. pathway to get to the shrine, and that's where you have like a really like valuable resource or something there, like a base. Or you just but paraglide. Nobody... If you get the paraglider, I don't know how he's gonna that work does... it with the other server, but I mean, right now we gotta unlock it, right? Yeah, you would just have to go. You just have to visit every single of the Shika, the the uh, little, you know, the things that you put the Shika slate on in the Sheikah Towers, Oops, you go up to all go this way. and you get to... Or at least all the ones that are in areas of the maps that have been built. So you don't have to go to the Elden Tower or the Akala Tower. Okay. Or Central Tower, either. Oh, yay, the giant purple statue. Oh, yeah, and the uh, tower over by the Lost Woods. So the four, so four of the towers you don't have to go to. Yes. Every Yeah. Giant purple statue. Who built that? I have no idea. What is it? No I, clue. I have no idea it's what that is. It's Evangelion. Oh. Evangelion. <laughs> yeah, that's just there. Just a giant statue. Great anime, by the way. I don't, yeah. I've seen images of it oh, before. Yeah. Never, never watched it. I'm not. I'm kind of anime it. deficient. Have not watched a lot of them. I don't really. Yeah, I'm not really. Hmm. I've watched some. Like, right now I'm watching uh, Delicious in Dungeon from Netflix. Mm. That one's silly, but it's fun. Uh. Oh, what's another one? Oh, oh, and um, what is it? Uh, level Up? Or I think it's just called Level Up. That's a pretty interesting one. That one, that one is centered around uh, one guy in a world of warriors who gets the ability to gain experience points which makes him more powerful over time and one way of getting those is by killing other people and there's this AI sort of voice that tells him what to do and if he doesn't do what the AI says then he dies interesting yes kind of a darker cool. one but still cool oh where'd they go yeah I don't know they've made some good progress here wow yeah they did Huh. Yeah, there's no resources left. The shulkers are empty. Okay, that was you. That scared the crap out of me. Oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> Look at this. There's actual trees around here too. That's part of the aesthetic. Yeah. There's supposed to be trees around it. Although we don't want to keep those here. We want to get rid of those eventually. We don't want to give them cover. Mm. Well, since I can't find them, I guess in the meantime, I'm going to do my Duolingo. I'll be in the basement. All right. What do we do? Sounds do we just hang out good. for now? Yeah, I think we sure. Just go All right, can't hear him anymore. We're now going to do Duolingo. And I'm gonna I'm gonna play overly dramatic music. Window capture, Duolingo. Duolingo. Ah, can't find it. What about this one? Oh wait, I got, I'm in the wrong one, that's why. Ah ha ha, right? No.
Okay, I can't find Duolingo. Why can't I find it? Well, maybe it's because it's a program. Okay, I'll, I'll add a source. We're gonna do Spanish, guys. I need to practice my Spanish today. Browser source, display capture, game cap. Maybe it's a game capture. Add new source, add source. No. Specific window. It's not showing Duolingo. Why? Filthy. Filthy. I don't know. I guess I could do display capture. I normally don't, but it, this time I'll just have to make an exception. We will do display capture. There we go. Well, that's the wrong one. See, this is the problem with display capture. It, it's, it's no control. There we go. Look at this. It's Duolingo. I'm on. I'm on. I'm on uh, the, the top ta one about expressing travel needs. I need help practicing for this because Duolingo is cool. Yes. So let's. Uh, what kind of song should we play while we're doing this? Shopping theme. Here we go. Which one of these is a suitcase? It is a maleta. La maleta. Good. Which one of these is a passport? El pasaporte. El pasaporte. Yo tengo un carro. Yo tengo un carro. I have a car. I know that one already. Ten. Tango is have to myself. It's like I have it. Oh, one moment. Let me um let me adjust this. Yes, now I can see you all. Awesome. Sí, Next. yo tengo un carro. Yes. Sí. I uh yo tengo have a un car. carro. There we go. Look at that. Duolingo is great. I love this. I can't believe it's free. It's like cheating. Yo tengo el pasaporte. Yo tengo el pasaporte. It's great. It's great. It's so easy to do this every day. Uh, and I also have the, the uh, what do you say, the premium version for another day. Because occasionally they'll give it to you for free as a reward, which is really cool. Uh, cartera. That'll be a hard one to remember. La cartera. La cartera. That doesn't sound like wallet. But that's wallet. Okay. Uh, purse. Cartera? Cartera. A purse is a cartera as well. Interesting. It's a wallet and a purse. Tienes el teléfono? Do, uh, do you have a telephone? Uh, have the telephone. The telephone. Tienes la maleta? Look at that. Tienes, Tienes u la maleta? Maleta. maleta. Suitcase? Yeah, do you have the suitcase? Tienes una cartera? Oh, somebody does the Russian Duolingo, says Reese and Polly. Cool, I like that. Uh, Natu says they learn French on Duolingo. French is a good language. Confusing. I'm, I'm doing Spanish because it's easier and probably more applicable. Um, I live in New York, but I've never met a French person. I have met some... Well, I guess I haven't met anybody that speaks Spanish either, but I know there are some people in my community who do. Yeah. Ooh, Omega Dan Kong says their sister is doing Latin. That's crazy. Tienes. Un, um, do you have a Cartera. Uh, purse? Purse. We're doing purse, not wallet this Ella time. Tiene una maleta. She has a wallet or a purse this time. She has a oh suitcase. Do it. Ha ha. Let me check on the server real quick, by the way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check on it really quick. Has anything happened since I've been gone? Oh, there's nobody around. Never mind. <clears throat> Back to Spanish. Load. There you go. And play the music again. I did not give you permission to stop. Usted. Um. Uh. Oh, do you? And then we have to figure out what this Usted. is. You, the passport. passport. It's probably. You have a passport. So do you have a passport would be what it is together. If we do quiero, that's want. Do you want a passport? Eres is um, you this the passport. That would make no sense. Or do you want to drink a passport? That's a dumb That's Tienes. a dumb one. Tienes el pasaporte? Do you have the passport? Yo is so necesito fun. mi boleto. It's so easy. Boleto. That's, um, well, I've never learned this boleto. one. Ticket. Boleto. Yes, uh, I need a ticket. No tienes el boleto? 
No tiene su... So, no. you don't have a Boleto. ticket. And then I could say, yes, the ticket is right here. Okay, now we gotta do a tough one. These are usually not that much harder, but we'll, we'll, we'll push through this. Let's see. Usted. Do... Uh... Ooh. Do you have a purse? Why is usted one of the options? I guess usted. that makes sense. Usted is a version of you. Usted tiene, tiene una... una... Cartera. Cartera. Yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. Now, usted is funny because you only say it when you're in a formal context, but we just have to assume in that situation. Oh, somebody else does Spanish Duolingo. Two people. Kef does it and... Oh, Kef said that twice. Never mind. <laughs> Ooh. Is I cow uh, was trying to do the Japanese Duolingo, but it's too hard. I agree. Japanese is a crazy language. Senor. I, I would learn it, but I've heard that it takes years just to get a basic fundamental understanding of it. So I'm not even going to try. That's, that's absurd. I'm going to do one that I have an actual chance at learning. Because, especially because Mexico is closer than Jap Japan is. Uh, so, senor, do you have a ticket? So, senor, um, tienes un boleto? Or tiene? Tiene. Uh, the ticket. El bole oh, wait a minute. They need me for something. Gents, how's it going? Hello, Brad. I speak Spanish. Did you know that? What? I speak Spanish. Tu, tu hablas espanol? Si. I was, this, or I was watching your Duolingo. I'm surprised you you know your Spanish. Es tu español uh, mucho bien? Yeah, it's my first language. What? Your first language is Spanish? <laughs> yeah. Whoa, I didn't know that. That's crazy. Where are you from? Like, generally. Uh, are, you an, are you American? Yeah. You're American, but it was your first language. That's crazy. I love that. I, I wish I had focused more on Spanish in high school, but I was awful at it because I didn't think it was interesting. <laughs> then I went on a missions trip to the Czech Republic. And while I was there, the missionaries were like, hey, show of hands, what languages do you guys know? Um, and it's this like older couple that was guiding us. And well, like one person, two people rose their hand out of 10. And they're like, come on, come on, not even Spanish. Spanish is so easy. <laughs> and at the moment I was thinking like, yeah, you know what? I can, I can learn Spanish. Duolingo mm -hmm. isn't that hard. You're That's doing good. good. Yeah, thank you. I also substitute teach for Spanish classes sometimes, so that helps. Oh, that helps, yeah. That, that, that helps. How's it going? Good. We went on our own side adventure. We got three towers done. Could could you place the bread box? We couldn't keep on building because you took it with oh, you. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't take it. I hid it because I didn't oh, want anybody okay. to take Smart. it. It's it's down here. Sorry. No, 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 no. That's not That's not on you. That's on me. I didn't coordinate, and I didn't think about that. Either of these have the resources we need. Yeah. Yep. I gotta, I gotta finish my Duolingo. I'll be back in a second. Oh, never mind. My Duolingo consisted of just, just finishing answering the last question and clicking continue. Yeah, very nice. 93 day streak. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Russ, Rusty the Ball said, I tried speedrunning Spanish Duolingo. I hope you did well. Yeah. Oh, but potato, we weren't weren't the Spanish with bread, and before that we raided the Yiga base. I don't know what that means, but yes, we raided the Yiga base, and then we practiced some Spanish. It's been going good. It's been going good. So I'm going to exit out of that, and we're going to go back to Minecraft. Um, I want to go back to window capture. Here. There we go. Back to Minecraft. I'm back, Again, Jens. Circle. Test. Just, just. Okay. Unfortunately, it is uh, getting kind of late for me, and I actually have to go help record a musical in a in half an hour, less than half an hour. Wow. So I'm gonna have That's to fun. get going. But it was an honor playing with both of you, getting the start of the Lookout Landing base. Hopefully, sometime this week we could finish it up. Probably not on live stream yeah. though. Uh, mm -hmm. And then we will conquer the world. Sounds good. Is that overly ambit is that overly ambitious? No. Nope. Okay. So I said it's not. We're gonna conquer the world. So I'm just gonna do what we always do at the end of the stream. I'm gonna pray us out, and then we will all do what we need to get done today. Maybe get dinner. Probably most of us get dinner. So dear God, thank you. We were all able to survive the weekend. Thank you. We were all able to explore the server. Nothing seemed to have gone wrong. 
we were able to goof out at goof off at Lookout Landing. Um, thank you for good food like bread, and thank you for good friends like the people on the server. In Jesus' name, Amen. Oh, whoa! What's this? Hey, Ortolum. Hey, how's it going? Not too bad. Yeah, uh, we we are we're establishing our uh, claim on land here in uh, in Lookout Landing. We, we're basically conquering the whole of Central Hyrule. It's kind of a big deal. I like it. Yeah, yeah. Nice shield, by the way. Classy. It looks like you finally used that uh, that Wither Skull. Yes. Yes, we did. Classy. Hey, do you want some? You want some uh, golden carrots? Yeah, if you've got some spare. Shoot, take them. I have bread. I'm pretty good. Sounds good. I was actually just about to sign off. I'd rather not eat that nozzle, but thanks. Oh, I'll eat it. Oh, when I when my hunger goes down. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna get going. Thanks for stopping by, everybody. Have fun storming the castle.